everybody. What's going on? What's going on? Let me sh- make sure we know. Good evening. Thank you for joining us. Let me make sure the camera's just right. <laughs> See, we have to use the Utah. No, you did. I say the Utah. <laughs> <laughs> We got to use the laptop <laughs> till we get our, till we get our camera, till we get our professional equipment. Like some of y'all YouTubers out there, we small time YouTubers. So, you know, it's hey, coming, it's coming though. It's coming though. But anyway, thanks everybody for tuning in who we got in here already. Mama said slow. Hey, what's up? What's going on? Who else in here? Is that the Soren Seaward family? Hey. How y'all doing? They said they can't hear us. Oh, shoot. Hold up, hold up. Did I turn it up? Oh, they should be able to hear now. Can you hear? Uh-oh. Oh, you can hear it. Okay. Hey. All right. All right. Also, my bad. I had it turned down because we was talking about some. We was gossiping. So I had it turned down at first. That's why you, that's why you probably saw our lips moving but didn't hear nothing. <laughs> but, uh, hey, who else in here? Hey, Miss Hawk. Miss Hall said she's stuck at work. Is is Nigel still here? I know Nigel said he came uh earlier, but we have to uh <laughs> we have to keep changing the time of the live because for some reason a stupid camera on the laptop it wouldn't it wouldn't populate. So we were sitting here all this time ready for like the last forty five minutes. I had to turn the computer off, restart it, close all my apps down. I don't know what. I, I don't we know. ready now? But anyway, anyway, we're ready now. So thanks everybody from coming over uh, from our from my other channel. Um, you guys who have been uh, supporting me on Tanya's Primetime TV Media Reviews and my Cake Decorating Channel, um, Tanya's Delight Slice by Slice. I appreciate appreciate you for following us over here. Um, I am Tanya, as most of you guys know, and we have Samantha. And, or you can call her Sam. Um, we are sisters from another mister. And most of you already have um, seen some of our uh, YouTube videos because we have been doing uh, movie reviews like once a month for maybe the last five, about five, five months. months. Yeah. yeah. So, but on my Tanya's reviews channel. So, um, we have decided to join first forces and create our own collab YouTube channel. So that's what this is. That's where you are. Thank you so much for coming to support us. Um, we're starting small, starting from the bottom. So we appreciate it. You guys share our lives, share our channel, um, link so that we can continue to grow and grow and grow. And we promise to bring you some very good entertainment. That we will. Yes, ma'am. Yes, <laughs> ma'am. But anyway, anyway, what's good, y'all? <laughs> um, Samantha and I, just to give you a little rundown, we go way back, like four flats on a Cadillac. I already say that. But anyway, we call each other family because we, you know, super close. Are. Mm-hmm. Yep. And we've been knowing each other for a long time, like I said. Um, so that's why we call ourselves sisters from another mister, because we are sisters in our eyes. <laughs> 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 but anyway, what what Miss All say? I'm stuck at work with men ooh, mandatory overtime. Oh, man. An yeah. eleven hour shift, missing a live. Oh that's okay, babes. You can watch it later. You can watch it later. She said, Hey, Samantha and Tanya. But I feel you. I didn't have to work uh, mandatory overtime today, but I did have to get up at like, oh my God, what time did I get up? Five? Hmm. Like five this morning. And I had to decorate a cake for somebody who needed a baby shower cake. And then I had to be at the nursing home for my 7.30 to 4 shift. So I'm like running on fumes here, but I'm here. <laughs> All right. All right. But anyway, um, we're doing a review on Us, the 2019 film that came out a few months ago. So that's what this uh, is going to be about. And then after we do the review, we can you can hang out with us. We can discuss, you know, whatever. 
Uh, we want to discuss whether it's something in the news or TV shows or something on YouTube, you know, whatever. Um, and we will have the phone lines open as well if you guys want to call in at the end of our review. But anyway, uh, first thing we always ask each other, I mean, ask you guys is your rating <laughs> of the movie. For those of y'all who watched this movie... <laughs> <laughs> I'm laughing because Samantha, she she was talk, she had me cracking up talking about this movie after we saw it. She was like, "What the hell did we just watch?" <laughs> I know what was happening. With. But uh, for those of y'all who saw the movie Us, we need y'all to rank it from one to ten. Let us know. Did you like it? Did you enjoy it? Did you understand it? And what did you get out of the movie? Like, a lot of people got a different interpretations of the movie, what we were supposed to learn, what we were supposed to feel, what we were supposed to think about it. So let us know, from your perspective, what you thought of the movie. Now, what what you want to rate it? <laughs> <laughs> Four and a half. Oh, a four and a, a half. Four and a half. Probably. She said a four. A po- okay, if we do a possible a five. Can we get a possible five? Five. Can we get po- possible like five. in space. Can yeah, we get a possible five? It. Y'all see our uh <laughs> our um thumbnail is co- two people playing spades at the card table. The name of our group. Let me let me tell you. We was thinking about you know names to give our channel. And oh, yeah. <laughs> I kind of was like, because of the fact that we're trying to base our channel on like two girls from the hood, we might not act hood all the time or ghetto all the time. <laughs> you know, the, the name of our channel is not about that, but we from the hood. So, so sometimes we might discuss like things that we went through in the hood, you know, on our channel. And in the hood, how many times you walked to somebody's house and they were playing bones or spades? So that's why I chose that picture for our thumbnail on our, you know, channel. But anywho, Samantha, you said, but it's all you said, your coworker said zero. You have not seen the movie. <laughs> well, Samantha gave it a four and a half. Five. No, Samantha gave it a five. She gave it a four and a possible. No, she gave it a five. <laughs> um, I think, I don't know what to give that movie. Um, honest to God, I don't know what to give that movie. Mm-hmm. That's the first um, one for me, too. The movie was so strange. I don't think I've ever seen a movie like that before. And I've seen a lot of movies. And I love scary movies i love horror movies i love all that gut wrenching stuff like saw i got every movie one through six or something like that of saw i like that gory gushy bloody stuff all that this was just really strange it's hard for me to i want to say i probably give it a six And and that's the lowest I've ever given a movie. Like that movie was, it was, it wasn't even all over the place. It was like you basically had to. Mm -mm. Spill it, Sam. Spill it. I don't know. And I know I bought a nine dollar drink up in there, and I was like, it had me so on uh, trying to figure it out. Trying to get your money back. Uh-huh. Did you want to go money back? I want my money back and <laughs> and some. I said, this movie right here is something special. This is something serious right here. All I want to say is, I mean, I mean, it was good and made it to the big screen yeah. to somebody. Don't get me wrong. And like some movies, we going to like it. Some movies, we not. Some other people will like them. But this movie, Us. It was very confusing to me because, first of all, at one point, it was like, it didn't even like, like, I always get it it, when I watch movies where they go back and forth too much for me. This movie was just like, it wasn't a back and forth thing this time for me. 
But this movie here was like when the when when the, the son came in and he said, "It's a family in our driveway," and then it was like it looked like us. Okay, I got I got where the title came from. Then yeah, it took me a minute to figure yeah. out why it was called us. But when they came to the driveway, <laughs> I was like, "Oh shit!" I was like, "I get it, we were like, okay, we get it." <laughs> That's what I said to and I'm like, okay, now we get this. I get this. The title, yeah. Then I said, t- 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 then we, we we started talking. And so then, it was only like six of us in the movie. Us yeah. two, a, a couple, and I think another girl and her friend or something. But anyway, it was not a amount of people that's in there at once. But only thing I say about this movie is, okay, they, they going on a summer vacation and they going back to... The wife's, I guess, when she grew up as a child or something. Mm-hmm. So then you thinking like, well, what happened to her? But once they get there and then it's, you know, they get ready for bed and and the husband, the wife kept saying she want to go back home and the husband was like, oh, I think I drove all this time. No, we staying here, whatever. Right. So finally the son come in the room and he like, it's a family in our driveway and he look like us. That's pretty much, we like, oh, stuff about to get real up in here. <laughs> No. <laughs> so then they all go out there. They get to look at the people. They got the slow boy running around like a wild hyena that's outside the Hold up. <laughs> <laughs> Did you say it? <laughs> the boy. Oh, my boy, God. I was like, what the hell, bro? I was, I was like, what is what wrong with him? Why is he? <laughs> he you know out. what it remind me of? You know how, uh, you know, uh, oh, Tarzan. Man. Oh yeah, the little boy <laughs> that you know Tarzan when he grew up with in the jungle, and he moved like the animals on all fours, and I was like, "What the heck? Why is he the? Why is he the only one the that moves are, like that?" Yeah. I, I thought that was crazy. Cause when they was in the driveway, everybody standing up, and then all of a sudden once they get up to the house with a family like them is that in the inside. What else, says boy? <laughs> <laughs> Then they got the little boy running around, and he making all these noises, and I'm like, so then they get to started to, like, break in the house, and then they gain entrance, and then the the, the wife, like, the the wife from the driveway, as I'm going to refer to this family, she tell the wife in the house to handcuff herself to the table, and, and so the house husband like no honey don't do it and then the housewife was like no yeah yeah it's okay then it gets to where they say t- the um the the driveway wife tell the the house daughter to run so then the driveway daughter start chasing her then they tell the little boy the house boy to take the little yeah, wild the boy little to the boy. cab to the little cover thing where he was playing in it was a whole bunch of stuff, and then the husband, the house husband, got he, he had, get beat up. He or had something. his knee broke in half. Nah, he got beat. Um, what? Okay, it was for just... those of y'all who have not seen the movie, let me get y'all first just a little bit. <laughs> yeah, you just might give a little, little bit. bit. Of here, but because uh, I, I ain't gonna this... be nice. I'm uh-huh. like, this Samantha, she tell. really did not like the movie. At all. I mean, not I, this one. I, 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 you just could make something like good said, in it, but I this didn't movie understand was just it. like. I mean, I understood oh. it, but I didn't understand it. Like, at the beginning, okay, the first part that had yeah, me, it, it, it just, it didn't flow right to me. Because, like, at the beginning, when they first got to the house, like, you didn't even know at first, like, if they were home, if this was a vacation house, if they were, right. I mean, you didn't know if they were at a, uh, Airbnb. I mean, I'm like, where are these people at? And then when they start mentioning, oh, we haven't been here in a year and everything. And then when the lady, the mom was acting all hysterical and having flashbacks about, you know, going into the mirror house, um, I forgot what they called it exactly. The fun mirror house. fun house, mirror fun house, something or something like that. Like yeah, that. yeah but I'm like, if she's this afraid, fest. yeah, I'm like, if she's this afraid, why is they there? Like, 
why are they at the beach? Like, why? She's ha- like, okay, they just said they were there last year. So, did this happen last year, too? I mean, <laughs> like, was she, yeah, ter- like, was she scared? Sudden, was she yeah. terrified? It's like, it, it, it left out a little bit there because it was like, they made it seem like she was just there. Like, they go there every year, but all of a sudden this year, she's freaking out and having flashbacks when she was little. So, that part, I was like, hmm. That's where my question came in at. That's one thing I was going to talk to you about. I, was gonna, I wanted to ask you about, like, okay, I, I felt the same way. That's why I was like, when we was in the movie, and I was like, do these people come here every year? And yeah. then there was some stuff, it was set up like, yes, yes. And then the way the house was so dated, I mean, I can understand if this is your vacation home. Yeah, it was home, dated like, like nobody gone. been there, but right. they kept saying we were just here last year. I didn't get that part. And then they had toys and stuff that, like, you would leave, like, if you only go somewhere like a certain time of the year, like people got vacation homes and they may live, they may go there for the winter. And when they come back, you know, they got all the summery stuff there. But as far as where they go to where they, the other nine months out of the year, whatever, like this place, the little boy had toys and stuff was set up. And it was almost like they went and they could look in drawers and like you say, well, even though I'm a year, I believe this. You know, two places you might not leave, but something that don't expire. You know, if something, you know, you can use it. You can't get it. Got, it yeah. Out. It was stuff like that around. And then it was just like, and then she said, I want to leave. The wife was like, I want to leave and I want to leave now. And the husband was like, nah. And, you know, not being funny, but you know how we is when we didn't go somewhere. We'd be like, we're going to, we're just going to take the bitter with the sweet till somebody right. get rested. I'm out of here. I would have been like, if I was her, I would have been like, uh, I'm out of here. You can stay here with the cheering. I'm out of here. I'm bouncing because she started to just feel this, this feeling she like something black wasn't cloud. a right. And I think it started when her uh, son, when she started panicking when she couldn't find him. Oh yeah, when he was in that little cubby thing, he playing mm-hmm. like like it's like like the cabinet, like it's a wall and it's a the cabinet and and. I mean, I'm, I'm oh, see, and the thing about house. it, he likes to hide him. a lot. That little boy likes to hide a lot. But when they were on the beach and she couldn't find him, he wasn't hiding. He was just, I can't remember where the heck he was. Where, do you Red even boy. remember? He had got it. Remember, he ended up downstairs in the locker. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's right. He in the locker down room. In a, in a, <laughs> remember when she found his in <laughs> the locker room. That's another thing. Like, I don't know. Some of the stuff, I don't know. It, it needed to be a little bit more explaining. I don't know. Maybe I'm slow. Maybe no, I'm, no, maybe I'm no. slow. Because, okay, like, for this instance. This is one of the movies you kind of make the movie as the viewer yourself to me. But, you, like, you when know. they went downstairs, remember at the end where she went downstairs when she was trying to find her, uh, her son? And oh, uh, yeah. it seemed like it was, like, 20 floors below. Oh, yeah. The she went down the like, escalator. Right. And I understand. <laughs> like, I understand that they were trying to say, you know, everywhere in the United States, we probably got like uh, tunnels underground. We got, you know, in some places they actually say, you know, there's actual cities under towns, you know, things like that. So there's tunnels, there's, um, Places that people used to travel, whether you were, like, escaping for someone or you were hiding someone or you were smuggling someone. So, I know there's, like, like the things underground. underground. Well, like, the Underground Railroad wasn't really underground, though. Well, yeah, but, you know again, I mean. they, but, like, I know what you're saying. Like, they go through them tunnels and, right. like, not being funny, but when they say, like, people smuggle stuff from Mexico. Right, that's what but, I'm talking yeah. about. That's what yeah, I'm look, talking about. Kinda, yeah, that's what yeah, I'm yeah, talking no, about. I'll get you on Like, that. for real, for real, like. A lot of these old, old houses, they have, like, bunks underneath and stuff. Just think, like now, how some people feel like, oh, the world is going to end. And you know how every year somebody, somebody knew, oh, the world is going to end. Then when that time comes, you know, and that person, they done already built their little shelter underground. And they have tunnels, you know. Mm-hmm. But you know what I'm saying. So, as far as this movie, when they was explaining that, I got that part. But when she was going down there looking for him... I was like, dang, she done went down 10 flights of stairs. <laughs> and and she done went down an escalator. I said, well, why is there an escalator four four? <laughs> I was thinking that too. Like, why what? is there an escalator? Then we said, where's she going? <laughs> I said, is she going to hell? <laughs> she, she was, was like an escalator four. It, it seemed like it 
it was like four right, floors Taya. below <laughs> the beach. Like four floors below the beach, there's an escalator. And there's locker rooms. And it seemed like a whole city down there. And I'm like, what the hell is going on? Because I think that's where she ended up being like raising herself at or something. Remember yeah. the classroom? Well, see, yeah. um, when they started bringing us to what was going on, like as far as the movie itself, as far as the movie itself, I'm going to read a plot that I found online. The plot says, this is the pl- a plot that I just found online. In 1986, young Adelaide Thomas goes on vacation with her parents in Santa Cruz. At the beach, Adelaide wanders off and enters a fun house, which has, you know, all the mirrors and stuff in there. Um, where she encounters a doppelganger of herself in the mirror. Uh, and a doppelganger is basically like, if you go into the front house and you see yourself in all the mirrors, you're going to see the front of you, you know, in all the mirrors, you're going to see the front of you. And if you look behind you, oh, the mirrors yeah. behind you, you're going to see the back of you. that's why I kind of freakish. But a doppelganger, if you look in the mirror... And you facing the mirror, and the person that you're looking at that's supposed to be you is turned around facing the same way you're facing. So you see the back of your head. Mm-hmm. That's the part of the house. That mind. creeped me out. When that Nick. little girl. <laughs> Looks like it's all too long. Other mirrors, <laughs> all the other mirrors, she saw herself, and she was, you know, it was like a normal reflection of herself. She got to this one mirror. And she turned around to look at the mirror and realized the image never turned around. I was <laughs> like, what the <laughs> heck? Run! <laughs> I was like, run! I was like, what the what That little what girl turned that? around and the face that she gave, it was like a real creepy, like... Uh, she was just like, oh my God. I was like, oh my God, run, run! <laughs> Somebody get the baby. Somebody get the baby. <laughs> but... <laughs> So she saw a doppelganger of herself in the Hall of Mirrors. Adelaide looked horrified, and then the scene cuts to black. And Adelaide is later reunited with oh, her yeah. parents. And remember, she was unable to speak yeah. after she was so terrified she wouldn't talk. I remember why though? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's what I was. That's where we. I got thrown at is because I'm like, okay. Not knowing why she wasn't able to speak, but then when I found out why she wasn't, it was more of uh, the the uh, a doppelganger. The doppelganger uh, had switched out lives, basically. Yeah, wasn't that crazy? Yeah, that was like the whole. <laughs> uh, okay. Me and this movie have a love hate relationship because I like <laughs> I really liked like where the movie was trying to go, mm, yeah. but it was I think it was I think they was doing too much, mm, and, and there and, was a lot of reviews out here saying the same thing like the movie was doing too darn much. Like, okay, before we found out what really supposedly happened, you know when she was a little girl. It was going to all these scenes like, um, well, no, 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 that was afterwards. I'm sorry. Afterwards, okay. Let me let me back up because my head my head is running faster <laughs> than my you know. But anywho, in the beginning, after uh, the son kind of like disappeared, then she found out where he was. She got back to the house. She got like paranoid and she just started having this strange feeling like something. Oh yeah, when she said she wanted to leave. Yeah. yeah, that's yeah. Now I did skip a lot to get to that. But I had to I really wanted to get out there about this family in a driveway and the boy told me something they or I forget which one, but I believe it was the son that was in the house said, Oh, and they look like us. Mm-hmm. So this 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 part didn't happen until after they went to the beach earlier. Right. Remember when they saw the people with the backup generator? Mm-hmm. And they came back and then she should have went home with them people, I told them. But now nah, they ain't going to listen to me. No, but when she told her husband we should leave, he was like, no. But it didn't matter because the, the people was already, in the, was already in the driveway. And why was they holding hands? <laughs> I was like, <laughs> I was like, why is they holding hands? And then it took me a second to realize, like, oh, my God, they look just like. 
That's what it's like. Oh like, yeah, that's why they the say family, us. I'm like, oh, okay, I got it. <laughs> this is why they call it us. I got it. This is why they call it us. And I was like, okay, I, I got this. I got this. But <laughs> but I guess everybody has their own theory and their own um, ideas on what the story was really trying to represent. Yeah. I think what it was really trying to represent, even though I think they did too much, it was all over the place and they dragged it out. Um, <laughs> I think what they was trying to represent was oh, when they was holding the uh, oh! <laughs> Okay, <laughs> it's like that's another thing. I know. Yeah, about why, was the movie? why was the theme song? Why was the theme song? I got five be. on it. I ain't know we about to start. Like, as well as we gonna start uh, freestyling smoking? or no, I what? No, they're about to bring out the bombs and everybody about to start smoking. It's about to be a party. Cause the kids was acting like they was the adults. Of- Oh, I, I can't and everybody tell my the favorite theater. part, though. I do have a favorite part. Everybody in the theater, every time that song came on, everybody, the white people, the black people. <laughs> everybody grooving like. Everybody, like, I got five on it. Hey. And then remember when that the, uh... toe back. <laughs> Messing with that sack. Okay. <laughs> but anyway, um. <laughs> I was like, why is they say like every thirty minutes the song five on it would come on like I so was Ooh. they the sponsor? Or I'm like, what, dang, what, yeah, what, did, what did the Looney down? sponsor the uh movie? I'm like I'm gonna need to speak with them. I don't I don't know. <laughs> I thought that was really, really strange. Hey, what was it? <laughs> Cause I wanna say my part I like. Okay, okay. Let me see. Um you and it was arguing about the <laughs> arguing about what? what it, Okay, at one point in the movie, y'all, I'm just going to keep it real. The family that was in the house got over to these people that, I guess they like, you know what, every year you might vacation at the same time with other people. So y'all kind of become like, I'm just going to say vacation friends. Yeah, vacation friends, family, whatever. So I want to say we'll have at the family house that they usually seem like they meet up with every year, but... Once the people that had the the family in the driveway that looked like them got away from the family that looked like them, whatever, they got to these people house that was supposed to be like, they felt like it was a safety net for them once they got there, but it really wasn't. But anywho, once the family get back outside, it was like, oh, we can take their car, whatever. Okay, if you running for your life, you ain't going to, you're not going to sit up here and say, well, I killed or I did this and I got this many bodies so I get to drive. They oh, arguing okay, and debate. And I'm now. like, ain't somebody trying to kill y'all? <laughs> what the world? I'm looking like, who gives a dang on how many people bodies you did? You know, they was arguing over who was going to drive. Who, who, the children with the parents though. I'm not going to see the mom and daddy. Having a the little bit, but the, 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 the kids, I'm with like. The parents, I was like, okay, okay, y'all doing too much. Just get <laughs> in the car and, and get go. on. Like, go, just drive. That uh-uh. was, that was That's irritating. That's the part. Now, I, I, I like that part only because I said, you know what? I remember when we was learning how to drive and we was coming up. And my parents used to say, y'all, we used to stay gone and we try to run off. But then when you get to the point, your friends drive, you like, you, your, your parents, parents, we all, it just, generations just mm-hmm. changes. But, us, me and my brother, we used to stick with my under my mom and them because they say, well, whoever go with us can drive home. They let us drive them home because you know they'd be probably one of somebody's house. Most likely my aunts or something. We over there having you know found whatever we do. But anyway, we used to, that, we that, that little bit of time gave me brought back memories a bit. Like my mom, and my dad used to let us drive home. But we weren't sitting up there saying, well, I'm I poured this many cups of juice or or got the kids to bed or something, you know, but nobody was trying to kill us. We just wanted to, we were just like arguing <laughs> about who going to drive. Just go. But they finna get, somebody trying to murder them. They finna and they choked. arguing about, yeah. And they said that time with some, well, I got this many bodies in this. And I was like, well, how the kids, anyway, it wasn't none, it wasn't even this family car. They just having to, it was just having to be a vehicle to get away. Yeah, so you think it happened to be, no, that's right. Remember they have, that was when they had, um, Okay, we, we skipped a bit. But uh, 
after the family, the original family, after they, I'm going to just say they twins. Yeah. That's what I'm going to yeah, call it. They yeah, twins. Yeah. So the movie is about, the movie is called, uh, Us. The movie is called, <clears throat> excuse me, the movie is called Us. So it's basically, um, a family who, there's another family that looks almost identical to them that's, that's, uh, what do you want to call it? Hunting them. Yeah. Um, torturing them. And once they had got away, or they thought they had got away, <laughs> they thought they had got away. I mean, they was fighting and making so bad. These people, I, it's like, dang, did they did they learn karate down there oh, yeah. underground? Did they judo? I mean, I'm like, what the hell was they doing? They doing cargos and flips and like. I'm, Stop, I man. mean, like I said, I think they just, they just, <laughs> I feel like a lot of other people feel like they just did too much in this movie. They did, they and did I, a little bit. It was too mm-hmm. many different, it was, it wasn't all that bad of a movie. Yeah, it wasn't all bad. That's why I said I have a love and hate for this movie. But it's kind but, of hard to even stay on track of what you want to talk about because it's more of, like, like, a lot of movies, like I said, I have problems with because, of course, I'm a 70s, 80s movie person or whatever. But, like, some of these movies, you might be here, and then they see you know, you out there doing something else or whatever. Like 10 it's, years down the line, then yeah. you go back 15 years, then you go back 5 years, then you go, yeah, all that back and <laughs> this forth. This movie wasn't even doing that. You didn't know if they was going to be on the, oh, remember the boat, though, the dad bought this boat? <laughs> When the boat needed the one the... that kept on stopping, <laughs> but it but it but it came on at the right times though, too. Because when that man climbed on the back of that boat, the oh, boat went in on him. The boat kept stopping, like the engine would keep stopping, and you got to keep you know pulling and pulling, trying to make it stop. Why and do you always buy uh, stuff like that though? It don't work when it posted, but then when it do, when it work on time, we like, oh, we know we invest in good, but let it don't do what we want to. We it, as, as human beings, period. It ain't no race thing. It ain't no nothing. It's just life. You buy something, and if it it can be brand new or not, but if it ain't performing how you want, when you want it, it's a bunch of right. Whatever. But that thing started when it was supposed to, and as soon as that man tried to climb on the back of that boat. <laughs> That engine, that blade just ripped right down his middle. Toe and and I, all you saw was... <laughs> I was like, oh my God, thank God it ain't no Jaws in the doggone ocean. Because <laughs> yeah, he... they would have all, everybody would have got ate up on that boat. But, um, that was... It was okay. It, was it wasn't that bad of a movie. What I recommend for laughs, yeah, but I it's mean, it's funny, I guess yeah, it has funny with... parts, yeah, like some of the parts was just so funny. You're like, what the, why? Remember <laughs> like, like, what are you doing? When they was outside, like, like at the park, <laughs> like at the theme park, or whatever. The girl got when she got lost. If people was outside, like standing on the corner talking or kissing or whatever, then they had like what they call a replica. Or whatever, when it's duplicate, a duplicate, like say it was a boyfriend and girlfriend standing out, standing I just at the park. They twins. Yeah, and then like it'll be like like another set of the same. People Everybody in the had a twin. That's yeah, what it yeah, that that's worked. What it that sounds better. To. Yeah, and that's yeah. why um a lot of people was like, okay, I, I kind of get where they trying to go. Like to me, again, I'm gonna go to. Uh, I keep saying I'm gonna read the. Uh, the plot. the plot. Let me finish reading the plot because I never finished reading the plot. So people who mm-hmm. haven't seen this could get what we're what because we all over the place. So let's um let me finish doing the plot. So anyway um after she's unable to speak after she was traumatized you know when she went into that mirror house her parents take her to see a therapist because of uh, they thought you know presumed emotional trauma that something happened to her when she had ran off. Um, they think maybe somebody hurt her, somebody touched her, you know, she won't speak about it. So basically they took her to see a therapist who basically just encouraged them, you know, encouraged her to draw, sing, dance, you know, something to express her emotions. So she started dancing. Um, but then in the present day, when she's older with her own family and they went to their family's beach house in Santa Cruz, um, her husband, Gabe and their children, Zora and Jason, um, 
she remembered, she started remembering like traumatic incident from her use in that mirror house. Um, so then she tries to, you know, leave and try to, you know, make her husband take them home. But he's like, no, I want to stay here. I want to kick it with our friends. You know, Josh and Kitty, that's the, uh, <laughs> that's the, uh, that vacation right there, friends. Man. Josh and Kitty. Josh and Kitty. Go man. see this movie for, just off of them too. Yeah. And when you see them, you're going to be like, uh, this is too... <laughs> But then, like, I don't even know what to say about him. it's just crazy. Like, okay, like, why was the man? Remember the man? Remember they kept seeing the man at the beach, the one oh, his hands dripping with, with blood. the blood. What like did a, that mean? I don't know because at the end, remember he was in the he was in there with his whole hand too, wasn't he? Uh, yeah, I but so. it was like both hands or something. I mean, I it's, that, it's very yeah. confusing. I was like, what does that mean? Standing up there, like, he just was standing there with his hands out. Now, I'm like, huh? And blood was only running down one, one hand. hand. Yeah, and then he had that hot little coat on his head. I didn't understand that at all. Um, and every time they would see that man, I'm thinking maybe he's a ghost or something. Yeah. But his hand was always bleeding, like just dripping. One hand. With blood, yeah. just one hand. Yeah. <laughs> so I didn't really understand that. Um, but anywho, before Adelaide could get her husband to leave, and by the way, um, Adelaide, she's played by Lupita Nyong'o. Um, she played in 12 Years a Slave. She's played in, um, Wakanda, you know, <laughs> Black Panther. She played in Black Panther. Um, and that was the whole reason why I went to see the movie. That's why I really wanted to see the movie. I kept telling you, I'm like, Lupita's in there, Lupita's in there. And, um, that was the whole reason why I went to see the movie. But um, I actually would have, if I, if I could do it all over again, I would have waited to watch it on DVD. Uh, what's that stick people be using? Fire Blue stick. stick, fire stick, red stick. I don't know. I would have, I would have waited to see it on something. That's that's just my. It was a good opinion. movie, but if if like just like you know, my sister said, I would wait to see it another way. But also, I would recommend purchasing it over. Getting it on like a bootleg or whatever, I wouldn't do it. It wasn't that bad of a movie. Yeah, it wasn't that bad to do no bootleg. It even wasn't really even a like bad everybody movie. Everybody nowadays do bootlegs. <laughs> I mean, give them the credit. It, it, I mean, like I said, I mean, it was somebody somewhere. You know, it was good. It was. It was. They, they thought well of it because it made it to the big screen, where some movies mm-hmm. don't. They go directly to DVDs and stuff like that, but. Well, no, what with this movie, it's just like, like, what, the, like the couple that they went, like when the when the family with their doubles, with the doubles, the, the family with the doubles made it to their friend house that looked like they meet up with every year on vacation because their doubles, their twins were trying to kill them, like oh yeah, remember they that. were trying to kill them and they couldn't understand. Why do these people look like us? Why are they trying to kill us? But you know, I mean, they were seriously trying to injure them and kill them, and they had no idea. Like, why do you look like me? Where did you come from? Why are you trying to kill me? Like, it was like no. Because basically, what I got out of sometimes <laughs> is I'm like somebody somewhere ain't like in a twin family. I'm thinking more. I like somebody. Something is wrong. But the husband of the the uh, twin film that was in the driveway, he you know he he got the eliminated early. So you know he was just gone. But then it was the mom and the kids, the mom, the daughter, and the daughter, a twin daughter from the driveway. Her, I don't know. She should have been somewhere running marathons or something. She right. <laughs> But, and remember when she killed Amanda? When oh, you talking about when she car. was trying to chase her? Yeah. See, it's so hard to explain this movie like, get because my car, get everybody, my car. everybody is twins. <laughs> like everybody is twins. So, like, okay, I guess like you can say the original girl. Um, the original girl, the original mom told her original girl, you know, the daughter, yeah, <laughs> to because... run for help. And so when she was t- running, she was booking it too because she um. She ran track, yeah, and everything, and so uh, she been running track for years. But so her, she was booking and she was gone. She was flying FloJo all the way. I mean, she that's was the gone. Name I'm looking for, when but I say, yeah, that doggone her her double, please, 
please. The original girl was all out of breath, sweating, <laughs> panting, about to have an asthma attack. And then she just looked up, and the double girl was like, I mean, I the way the she was looking at her, like, she double hockey stick, what I'm doing? And then the woman, I'm like, I mean, I know it was they, they were trying to get like a duplicate, but I'm just like, uh-uh. That one right there that they had played a twin for the one for the original girl, mm-mm. Yeah. she was scary looking. I ain't she gonna was. lie. I, ain't I like think she was the scariest. First, well, the boy. Yeah, the boy. First, I thought he was, but that girl just started acting with more weird, weird. And like the boy, like, why was his face? Was it because I don't he, know, really had I know lighters he had and stuff. the lighters, and I guess he like... He like Maybe set with, his face on fire or it something. Looked like more of a, uh, it looked they like, call it a chemical burn or something. Yeah. And he didn't get. He needed plastic surgery, but he didn't get it. And he was acting like a. I don't know. He was acting like an A. I don't a, know what the hell a, was. What? He wasn't like, acting like no regular. I animal. Didn't, yeah, everybody else is walking and running, and he's <laughs> crawling around like a little <laughs> chimp or a monkey or a, or I don't I don't know what I don't uh, know what to do. <laughs> Like, uh, a ring of train? I mean, I don't know. <laughs> I was looking like he, he, I'm like, he, why is he walking like that? Why is he hopping like that? I'm like, I, that was I didn't understand that. Um, they never did explain that. But one thing I did get early, not early, but it it was alright. It was it was decent. But with the the twin mom, you know, she was the original girl, right? So the, the 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 wife that came to the house with the man was the girl that was in the house. Cause remember the t- uh, yeah the daughter. That's why she wasn't talking and stuff. Remember, right? Cause she really had yeah, never been exposed sense. to the world. Once you get down into the movie, it mm-hmm. will. But well, once they started is, going back into time, remember when the the two moms, the doubles, the original mom and the. Uh, the double mom, the twin mom, the driveway mom, the dry. <laughs> See, it's just hard to, to explain. But anyway, the imposters who look exactly right, like thing. the real family, the imposters who look, the imposter mom, when she was trying to explain to her, because the real mom kept saying, "Why are you doing this? Why are you? Why are you trying to kill us? Why? What? What gives?" And so the imposter mom. She was trying to tell her, you know, why. And so she started going back down memory lane. And she brought the girl back to when she was little at the beach with her family. Went to the fun house. Ended up going in the fun house and ended up downstairs. Because, like I said, it seemed like oh, it was yeah, like four yeah. or five floors below the fun house. I mean, you just go down and down and escalator. down. You get on an escalator <laughs> going down. Then you get on one of those conve- – like the airport – where you where oh, yeah, where that that escalator. Let you smooth through yeah, it. the one that just takes you straight straight across <laughs> like an escalator. Yeah. Um yeah. it was like I thought they was going to hell. I'm like, if they go down one more level, they gonna see Satan. Like <laughs> <laughs> I was seriously like, What where are they going? But anyway, um <laughs> Anyway, when she got down there, I'm serious. I'm like, Jesus. it's about to get a hundred in hell. The, the t- <laughs> oh, what? Samantha <laughs> so almost choked on her drink. She said a hundred in hell. I mean, the I temperature, the temperature is about to get a hundred in hell if they get, if they went down any further. Like for real, but. <laughs> When they got down there, and the little girl, like the real mom, yeah, the real, the real little girl from back in the day that really went down in there because you you got to remember there's doubles, there's twins, everybody has a twin in this movie. So the girl, they start showing the story, and what it looked like, this is what it looked like. It looked like the little Ooh. girl who had got lost. When she was young and, you know, got traumatized and everything, then grew up and not speaking, um, they show a little girl who looks just like her go all the way down in the uh, mirror house. Once they got to the bottom, you just start seeing people that looked like everybody above ground yeah. who was at the amusement park. Everybody, like, say we were right here. Just say we were right here, and me and Sam, we sitting right here on YouTube talking to y'all. 
there would be somebody like 10 floors under the earth doing the same exact thing that we're yeah, doing, but they don't yeah. have a laptop and they don't have a table and they don't have a chair and they don't have the lights and all this, but they, 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 uh, <laughs> imitating our actions. Right. Like if I turn and talk to her 10 floors down, they my doing double is doing the same thing. Yeah. Like, and if I do a cartwheel right now on YouTube, 10 floors down under the ground, my <laughs> double is going to do a cartwheel. So everything we're doing on top of earth, they I mean not earth, but on look. top of land, they duplicate. If you at the grocery store with your child right now screaming and about to whoop their butt because they keep asking for some snacks and you don't want to buy no snacks, 10 floors down under the earth is a mama with, who looks just like you, with a child who looks just like you. They might not have the cart. They might not be in the grocery store. They're just imitating what you're doing. Mm-hmm. And if you were whooping your child, they would just be standing under the ground whooping the child. That, yeah. So it was like so weird. Like, why are these down. people doing the same thing? And it was like everybody, everybody who was at the <laughs> carnival, everybody who was at the carnival, whether they was eating cotton candy or swimming in the beach, they down 10 floors down swimming with no water. Just just yeah, imitating, uh-huh. just imitating their double who's on land or on earth. That part just had me like. I ain't know it had me throw. Girl throwed. I was like, I was like, what the? What in the what? H-E double hockey sticks is going on? <laughs> Tell you what you said. Like the H-E double hockey sticks. They going to be hot <laughs> <that. laughs> I was like, what You know the? what? No, honestly. Every every summer when it's real hot, I always use that term and people be cracking up. They'd be like, You said it's what temperature? It's a hundred and hell. That's what it that feels like outside. A awesome. hundred and hell. That's what it feels like <laughs> when it be hot in the summertime. They'd be like, What's the temperature? It's so hot a hundred and hell. <laughs> <laughs> They'd be like don't y'all be out there using my words, though. No, if I, I hear oh, anybody stole it. It's it, stolen. If I hear anybody say it, I'm going to show be like, you stole it from me. Uh, I, uh, you know, uh, I got this from my sister. It's hotter than 100 in hell. No, it's not 100 in hell. It's not hotter than... It's 100 in hell. Just 100 in hell. Yeah, like, what's the matter? It's 100 in hell. That's right. <laughs> like, uh, 100 in hell. Not it's a hotter than 100 in hell. It's 100 in hell. And but I anyway. like the heat. I don't like to be cold, but I don't know. I want a hundred in hell opposites. now. We opposites. Tell I'll me. be over her house. <laughs> it be winter time, child. Mm, I'll be so over her house, and I swear she got the heat on ninety. Now, yes, it be cold outside. Yes, it be cold outside. Mm, yeah, but summer. most people be having their heat on like seventy three, <laughs> seventy four, maybe mm. seventy five, maybe if it's real cold outside. I'm going to be over here taking my clothes off. It's hot. <laughs> I ain't care what it's hot. Where the fan at? Where the hot? Open the window. Where the fan at? Where the fan at? Oh, no. Yeah, one time I came over the house, I said, I am leaving. I can't take it. It's too hot. I was trying to kick it with my sis. I, I couldn't do it. Nope. <laughs> said, I got to go. I got to yeah, go. go. Open the window. Man, I, I think I had opened the door or something to let some cool air my room, you was like, oh, hell no. Uh-uh. It was a hundred in hell. No. Mm. <laughs> That's what. But to, yeah, we got to tell them about them when they got over to the what's it, what the couple name again? It was <laughs> the couple. We talking about Josh and Kitty. Josh and Kitty. Kitty. And Josh and Kitty the had Tylers. a set of real, the Tylers. The Tylers. They had a real set of twin teenage daughters. Yeah. Oh yeah. Mary, I was like, okay, you thinking that this family right here? They 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 got they got the backup generator, so they got their stuff together. Even they got twisted. Yeah, when all the power and stuff went out because of the doubles, the double. Uh-huh. Alexa. Mm-hmm. Remember Alexa was on and they said, Alexa, when she was playing, what that song by Ice Cube or somebody? What was that song I they were playing? Was, uh, um, oh, my God. Uh, I can't remember. And remember, it was, it, it, it said, it, and every time they would say it, you know how everybody know basically how Alexa works. So if you say Alexa, if you even, if Alexa is, I guess, like, program, I don't know how she works because I'm a Bible because I love that thing now. 
Oh yeah, but, I love my Lex Alexa. But you know how like you might be saying, uh, yeah, they had an Alexa in the in the movie, but it wasn't called Alexa. They gave it a different name, you know, so they couldn't <clears throat> probably have to pay Alexa to use their name in the movie. What, but what they, like if you would say like it was like I don't know what what would you call it like any song you say anything you say like you would use a phrase. And Alexa would just start playing a song or whatever. Mm-hmm. But I forgot that, right? It, it no, was Alexa song started doing other stuff. It. Like, like talk, Alexa went crazy. She was saying all kind of weird stuff. <laughs> uh, you are going to get murdered. You are. Oh, they are what? here. The Run. I was like, what, what happened to Alexa? <laughs> then the upstairs and the mama. I'm like, why come though? The man and the. If Tyler's dad was sitting downstairs and the lady came and she hear a noise, he like, nah, I'm just like, mm-mm. I thought, this movie was so, it was not more scary. It was just like figuring it out. Yeah, it wasn't I'm that I'm like, scary. I don't know if I'm going to go home, go to sleep, be woke, and I got to work in the morning. You go home, go to bed. Oh, uh, yeah. If you think, don't if you think it, it, it's going to be something Go watch scary. it and go to bed. It, it has its scary moments i think one i think once in the whole movie i think once i jumped oh, i was like ah but i was like ah you know like kevin hart ah that's all <laughs> i gave it ah that's all it was ah <laughs> no. remember, remember when the dad was getting chased by the um when his broken when his broken in the other man was chasing you like is he still really running I'm like, <laughs> and the man was you know, like Michael Myers, when Michael Myers be chasing you, he don't be chasing you. He just be there. Yeah, it's like, they just, it, like, like somebody, okay, it was, well, I don't know why I always remind me of this. I guess because me, I don't like seeing people forget, like, little, it might be basic to some people, you don't even know what it means. But, like, say you at, at a get together or something, and somebody leave, maybe they key or, you know, they got they gather and they plates up because mm-hmm. the barbecues I go to people are taking some to eat and they leave their keys like it ain't they gotta get in the car. But you'll be like, oh shoot! So you you know you running and you like, but you That's you me. you might be calling the That's person, me. but the man wasn't the man that was chasing the other guy. He wasn't calling him, but that's how he was going behind him like, oh hey hey so and so your keys or or your 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 charger. Let's do more like the phone charger. So you might be like, oh. So and so would have got their charge, so you chasing them and you like, hey, 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 David, your charge. But you're not really in the movie he wasn't talking to you like, is he trying to catch a woman to give him something? Like or you be like, I meant to give you this money but I want everybody to see it or something. Like he owed him something or something and you try to he catch him for the get kill him. That's but he wasn't chasing this but man like he was walking. trying to kill him. He was walking like I will get you when I get like, you. Like 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 Michael Myers. Like he I got out there to like, kill you. You running and Michael Myers like. <laughs> uh, yeah, and more of like a truck. What they call that when they taunt you a truck? Tra- just walking all normal. Like a, oh, I'm gonna catch you. Yeah. More of like when you doing a race and they say don't strike out running at 100 percent when you first start doing like the marathon or like them two the walks and yeah, stuff. Yeah, start at a steady like when I who should I be doing them too. Aesthetic. But like when we used to do the walk and stuff for like the uh different organizations or whatever, you know they said don't 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 like don't start out giving and stuff. Yeah, yeah, don't start giving your whole one hundred. That's how that man was chasing, walking behind him. I'm like, is he trying to get him or he just wanna catch up and have a beer? <laughs> you know what? <laughs> I'm gonna say this. And, and it might be stereotypical. I don't care. But remember when I said black people ain't they supposed to run? Remember when I said that? Cause we, I'm because we, I'm gonna be me. I'm gonna say me. They was like, when you hear a sound, okay, most movies, most movies, you know especially it, if it's a killer, a murder, a horror movie, you know the black people. It, it's a stereotype. They, 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 they joke about it all the time. When we hear a noise. We ain't trying to go find a noise. Not normal. Pew. That's the normal one of us. Because I know me. I'm, I'm like, be like, what are Grab the going? kids. Grab the kids. Save yourself. You better <laughs> hope you grab the like kids. Like on the airplane save when they yourself. say, put your, uh, put, put your mask on. Put, your, put yours on first and then help somebody your else. Yes, Jesus. Yep. 
That's how. <laughs> and they show me tell you that on the airplane. They show what Put your oxygen on first, <laughs> and then and then try to put help somebody else do their. Yeah, you got sec- to secure your own first to the ground. I'm sorry. After my oxygen, I'm be praying. I'm be too busy praying. <laughs> Save yourself. <laughs> But that's how save yourself. <laughs> Look at like. Save yourself. Man, boy, no, no, no. I'm gonna be praying <laughs> to every God. I'm gonna be praying. You be like, uh-uh. save yourself. I am. I'm. Just, I'm. That's what I'm gonna do. But it's like you're like, why? It was crazy because I was like, I swear to God, <laughs> but it was like man every noise. Down the stairs, you like. He's like, let me go see what the noise is. No, the, oh, you're black. You're black. You're supposed to run the opposite way. I don't know why. <laughs> and it, it, it do make you laugh as you think about it, but I, it, 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 it has some funny moments, yeah. <laughs> it wasn't scary at all. It was like one <laughs> scene where I was just like, eh. <laughs> You ain't scared, but you more like, you like, us, me being me, and it's always been like that. Even when we was little, we'd take kids, like you got the kids or something. You can hear some. You can hear like like even when you hear like brakes on a car. Like Ur! yeah, let somebody come running downstairs right now. We know we the only one here. I'm gonna be out this patio. Then we gonna like, talk. Hopefully we grab a phone. But other than that, mm-mm. uh uh uh, let's see my phone right here. So I'm gonna grab my phone on the way out. And I'm just gonna get my son. And and he better ask come questions on. later. I'm I'm serious. I didn't have mm-hmm. you ever had that happen for real though when you in the house. Remember like when I'm by you told myself. Me? Y'all was over yo. Over who else was that? And you said y'all had left the door open, and some dude was running. Y'all was over somebody else one time. It's been some years ago, mm-hmm. and you said y'all all ran up in the house, and then whoever they was looking for ran up in the house with y'all. <laughs> <laughs> I I was scared there because I was like, oh, okay. no, man, that happened to my Tita. Real story, real story <laughs> yeah, though. That was it. it now, wasn't <laughs> it wasn't that the door was open. We opened the door. Somebody was banging on the door. I ain't even gonna say their names. I ain't, <laughs> I ain't even gonna say their names. So this is a real story. But now we was in the was hood. Funny. We was like living deep in the hood. Then that and was. um, <laughs> some something happened. Somebody did something. That's all I'm gonna say. They did something, and they came banging on our door. And we was like, who is that who banging like the police? <laughs> Next thing you know, we hear sirens. It sounds like a hundred police cars. We hear sirens, helicopters. I mean, you could tell this helicopter, just the noise and everything, the sirens. <laughs> you can hear the police cars racing down the street. And the the, the door is boom, 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 Let me in, let me in, let me in. And we up there like, oh, my God, well, should we open the door? Should we open the door? Oh, my God, oh, my God. Oh, my God. They let me in, let me in. I'm like, okay, okay. As soon as we opened the door, they took off. It was like three people. They took off, ran through the house. <laughs> I mean, ran out the back door, and we just standing there like this. <laughs> Watching them run past well, you us. Call me ran out the front like, door huh? And ran out the front door and just went out the back. <laughs> and so we're up there like... <laughs> I'm expecting the police to come running in next. I mean, you you just stuck. Like you don't know what to do. You don't know what to do, and you just like stuck. Like oh my god, the police coming here pulling out guns. We got we got little kids in the house. We, we didn't know what to I do. Cried. I was I was glad y'all everybody was okay, but you was like you ain't on that. We didn't know what to do, and then like after that, nothing happened. It was like. The noises died down. The helicopter, you tell, faded away. And I'm like, well, I, should we lock the... I mean, we, we locked the back door. We locked the front door. Um, the person who <laughs> ran through the house, I was trying to call him. No answer. Um, the next morning, do, 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 do. I'm not even thinking about last night. Open the door and it's that person. The main one that ran through our house. Where the heck? What happened? Where the Oh, we was hiding in your dog house all night. <laughs> we didn't even have a dog. The house that we moved in had a dog house already there. And it was those big old houses. Like whoever had the house before had a big old dog because it was a big old dog house. Like you could fit like three, four people in there and the dogs. So it was a big dog house. 
and they were in there all night. <laughs> I'm like, what the hell happened? I mean, I, I eventually found out what happened. But That's again, funny to me. You I'm not gonna say who, like... who it was. But as you see, the name of this channel is called the Hood Channel, the Hood Table. Tell them what so, jump off. From time to time, we gonna tell y'all stories from the hood. Tales from the hood. That's a good one, but, though. Girl, that was that. It made I mean, me think, because, like, how, when you said they just ran up in the house They just ran, ran out. up in the house and ran out the back door. And they was like, pew! And we just watched them one by one. Like, what is going on? Like, yeah, what? I think it's a children. I didn't, know if it the was like, I didn't know if it was like the police was going to come through or somebody was chasing <laughs> them. Like, somebody was after them and not the police. Like, we really didn't have no time to react <laughs> Once we opened the door and everybody was just like, what? <laughs> what? Yeah, the back. Where are y'all up. going? And I'm thinking they went out the back door and I'm, I didn't know if they got arrested. I don't know if they got killed. I didn't know what happened. A lot of times, though, us being, and it, and, and, and it is being stereo, like it's a stereotype thing. That you but, run when something, when you hear but something. But it ain't no lie because I remember as a kid. Been hanging out with my mom and them, and we sitting around, or even after I started going off and doing things on my own. And it ain't it funny, but it is in real life. I've seen it both ways. I'm gonna tell you, it could be all, it could be four, whatever, how many different races, cultures, or whatever you want to call it. It can be five of each different one. I guarantee, I ain't gonna say. Out of all the races in the world, in the African American race, I guarantee if all five of them don't run, four no. and a half, and the other one gonna be scared. The darker tones, the, the darker the, tones. The, the dark skin gonna break out. <laughs> the more darker you are, and then the they be stuff. We're going to be running and cussing and we're going to be trying to grab. A, nowadays, you're oh, trying so to grab sad. your keys and the phone and your keys, and you like, uh uh-uh. uh. Mm-mm. That's why I always keep my phone close to me. I don't care if I'm cooking. I don't care if I'm taking a shower. If I'm um, in the basement doing laundry. If I'm outside, um, like okay, sometimes you know how you got to go outside to your car in the middle of the night because you Hang forgot on. something, or lower like sometimes you got you forget to take out the trash and it's five o'clock in the morning. You want to beat the trash man? I it's mean, standing next week. I'll be. <laughs> I'm like some niggas. I'll be like, I'm like some niggas in the job or something put it in the trash. I grab my cell phone. I, ain't taking I, sh- I sure do. I Not sure a do. Sure do because I'll be like, as soon as soon as I hear anything, let me hear a little a <laughs> let crack jump off in a tree branch. Crack. <laughs> pew. You know how to do it, like pew. Like, pew. To the <laughs> left. To the left, I'm gone. <laughs> mm-hmm. I used to walk and do all kind of stuff at night. Now, oh no, Mm-mm. oh no, 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 no. Mm-mm. I remember this one time. Oh my God, I remember this so clear as day. Here's another hood story. <clears throat> Excuse me, I remember this one time. I had a. Uh, how old was I? I was probably. Okay, you remember before they built the North Freeway? Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, before they built the North Freeway, um, it was all grass, remember? And it was like one bridge that was Bristol. Remember? Oh, yeah. Or was it Benny? No, it was Bristol. Yep, it was Bristol. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. It was Bristol. And we used to walk that bridge sometimes. To get on the other side to, to 30th Street. Oh yeah, right. yeah, yeah. We, yeah. Well, we yeah. were on the 24th. Yeah. yeah, we were on the other side. Yeah, we were closer to. She the was on the bougie Street. side. 30th. Yeah, we was, y'all was over there, <laughs> and that's where we was walking to. But sometimes, yeah. remember, it was a whole bunch of land. It was just all grass, oh, yeah. so you when could walk. It up. Right, you could just walk across if you want. But if we were going to the projects. That way, because the project went all the way from this way. Oh, yeah, on Bristol, you can right, walk straight down right, like you still right, can. Walk now, right, walk huh? yeah, into the projects. Yeah. So, if we weren't going to the projects and we were, like, going to Kelly's, we would just go through the grass sometimes, just walk through the grass. But one time I had went to the store and I had went to Kelly's liquor store to buy me some 
um, snacks with my little dollar, probably with a food stamp or something. I had mama, you know, back then we got food stamps. No shit. No, no. Don't care. I ain't shame. <laughs> we used to get food stamps when we was little. I but, found um, the paper food stamp. In a book now, I said, actually, I you found should put it book. in a picture frame. I gotta go and get it. <laughs> but actually, it was a, it's a whole. Mo- I ain't lying. I must, it must have one of the times I thought I had came up on the lottery or something. Cause I was like, I found the- some. It's, it was a, I know it's a five in there for sure. Remember the brown, she remember the brown, the food. I After would, they got the EBT card, <laughs> trying to still try and to And I know it's I wonder how long they were for. Second After baby. the EBT card, did they automatically like cut off like? You had till this day to use your last food stamp. Somebody probably <laughs> sold them first and then got their card. Yeah, that's probably how it went. Okay, but I had, I had, it had, it had, I know it had the, um, which one? The, the five was blue. Girl, I don't remember. I know a dollar. Everybody on here, I don't care who you was. I don't care if your mama or grandmama or nobody. Who raised you? Y'all can say y'all to get food stamps. That's your business. But everybody Somebody saw in your food family. Stamp. On a holiday, some of that food, your mama might not have had no food stamps, but somebody at that holiday, at that table, the food had was purchased some food with stamps some stamps. And government cheese. And some government. No, it's the government. Mac- government. 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 I cheese. bet that, because the macaroni ain't banging unless you throw That's a couple the, slices ooh, of that up in it. Ooh, ooh, wee. Mm. But anyway, let me finish my story. In, yeah. <laughs> Girl, I was okay. I had walked to the store from Kelly's, came back with my candy, and I was walking over the bridge over Bristol to come back because we stayed directly across the street from where they started tearing down for the freeway. So basically, the whole time they was building the freeway, we was facing the freeway. Our house was facing the freeway. Oh, thanks, Miss Lady Scoop. (laughs) (laughs) We tried. (laughs) Our house was facing the um. Like, directly, like, in front of our house was a street. Directly on the other side of that street was a whole bunch of used-to-be land, and they started tearing that up to build the freeway. So the freeway was literally, like, across the street oh, from our house. Know, could you, before right. they that freeway, could you just go straight? You could just straight from, and just walk okay, across I, the grass. Yeah, I that's should what know that. Doing. I shouldn't remember Girl, that. I know because we stayed there. We stayed in that hood for a long time. But um, I think my husband was living over there. Oh, Lord. I should find him. Anywho, 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 I was walking home from Kelly's and I had took, I said, decided to take the Bristol Bridge instead of walking through all, because sometimes the grass would get all high, you know, and these thicker mm-hmm. bushes. And so I walked across the bridge and like on the bridge, there was a man that had started following me. I don't know when he got behind me, but there was a man that started following me and he looked just like. Why you know how people look suspect. Like that. Just look suspect. Remember Booty Freaky Fred? That's mm-hmm. why. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I you, That's a story for another again. day. Ask me, ask me that again, Tanya. Remember who? <laughs> <laughs> I can't even say it with a straight face like, now. You remember when we used to go get the Nikes and the Adidas? I can't finish my story. That's how you done said it. You remember we should go to the mall because it's nice. The booty, booty you cream. Remember, you remember booty <laughs> free friend. You you said it like like he a shoe or something. You remember, you remember the Nikes <laughs> when when the Adidas first came out or something? Like, oh. Oh, stop. That's you. I'm trying to tell my story. Oh, you're talking about something. You remember booty free <laughs> friend. I remember the dealing man. <laughs> okay. That's he another used to be story. By kind of for another day. <laughs> Booty Freaky Fred should be by Power Kennedy, remember? Adams Hill, remember? I'm going to tell you something. What they call it? Okay, okay. Me Let me finish like, my story, you y'all. <laughs> okay, so, you be quiet. He kept me um, in shape as a child. Booty Freaky Fred, he kept me in shape. That's what it Okay. Chase you down. We're going to say that story for another day. <laughs> but anyway, I was over the bridge, and I, there's this guy that was chasing me. Not chasing me. He was following me. And you know how you just get a sense? Like, something ain't right. Even when I was, like, in the fourth grade or third grade, however old I was, I knew that something wasn't right. And every time I turned around, the dude just gave me, like, this weird look, you know? And so, anyway, I started to hasten my pace. And I started to walk, I started to walk a little faster. And, and what you with my snacks in my hand, I started to walk a little faster. And, um... 
He started walking a little faster. I started walking a little faster. He started walking. It, it reminded me of Michael Myers. He, he, he seemed like he was always there. And so then I just knew to just book it. You know what I mean? <laughs> say, she straight booked. I mean, I straight booked it with my little legs and I was gone. This man was chasing me. I went, flew off that bridge. Remember how we came around the bridge and it was grass? Mm-hmm. Remember it was a hill? Oh, yeah. You told me you come off bridge. That though. dirt. Because everybody used to cut down the hill as soon as you get off the bridge. And so and it was like it a wore dirt it down. Like they a wore it down. Bad carpet. Girl, all the <laughs> dust all in my hair. Hair was fresh to death. Mama done braided my hair up. You know, all that stuff. I'm up there booking it. This man chased me. I started screaming at the top of my lungs. Help! Help! Booty Freaky Fred! Booty Because I've never seen Booty Freaky Fred, but I knew that he was some crazy guy who allegedly, I can't allegedly, wait to tell you what, oh my God, you was a man. Kidnap kids, murder them, and do all kinds <laughs> of crazy stuff to them. So I'm thinking, I'm only in like the third grade. I'm like, Booty Freaky Fred! I'm just screaming at the top of my lungs. Next thing I know, my mom and dad come out the house because I'm close to the house by then. They, they said, then when the man saw other people coming, because I was screaming, like I used to have a Mariah Carey voice when I was younger, like real high pitched voice. And he just immediately turned, What's like he went and just turned around and ran the opposite way. I don't know what was going to happen to me if he caught me, but I know by the grace of God it didn't happen that day. But I mean, that's what I'm saying. Like, you it, it might crazy. be a stereotype that when black people sense something's wrong, we that's just, without thinking, we just fight or flight. Fight or flight. Like, I'm not fighting you because I'm only like this little, and you like this big, and you look crazy. Like, <laughs> if I go with you, I'll never you see my family man. again. I'm gonna be on a milk carton. <laughs> I'll be on a milk carton, and, and Mr. Walsh. <laughs> of be talking about me uh, on America's Lord. Most Wanted. Jesus. I'm serious. I, <laughs> you know, you have like, you you start sensing all these things and you just know danger. Stranger danger. Remember that? <laughs> you don't remember Stranger Danger? Okay. Okay. Do I want to remember You a nut. <laughs> You remember Booty Freaky Fred? Yeah. <laughs> I did say it all straight face. Like, like, yeah, what? Yeah, you remember, like, he you was just you like the next door neighbor. You remember everybody was wearing Sergio Valente? <laughs> oh, oh, this what? lady scoop oh, crack it up. Oh, whatever it's called. <laughs> yeah, Calvin. I couldn't even get my story out. I'm telling you. You remember Calvin Klein? Yeah, baby. I was just like, you remember Booty Freaky Fred? Like, yeah, ooh. you, I was like, huh? Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, I remember. That was like I remember he used to chase us from the Civic out of. To- I remember. That's why that to was, this day I said you can run. You just ain't been running. I told him I was like I'm gonna stop saying I can't and I'm gonna do because that's a lie. Because I'm gonna tell you something. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I remember anybody from anybody that know what I'm talking about. Downtown to your house is more than where we used to live. I say. You getting a few were y'all miles off of 40th in. then, or was were y'all still in the bricks? Was in the bricks. The bricks. The I AKA tell, the projects. Yep. Yeah. And I tell you something. We all lived in them. If you know <laughs> where the where the, the auditorium was, even to get to That's the a nice even walk. to get to even to get to just to like Lake the Street. Hood. No, because Lake Street was not even the projects. It, it, I mean, oh, I you talking about lie. Vietnam Project? Even it, no, you know. them too. But sometimes when you going over somebody else, because those time I stay with my people somewhere else. But to get to where well, you just everywhere. talking about Bristol to run basically almost to from the Civic Auditorium. Day, that's a long walk. Yeah, no, that's a run. I'm gonna tell you something. And sit here to this day, every time that you came run, that's a lot. You ran all the way from the Civic. Oh, uh, and then you know that's when that's when you had. <laughs> True friends, cause they be like, you better be. Uh, uh-uh, uh, they wouldn't be. We wouldn't. We wouldn't even cussing and having filthy mouths. It was more. You better come on, cause he gonna. He gonna do this. He got all oh, that back then. You were like, uh, uh-uh, uh, and that's the thought. If you see this man, and the thing about it, I never woo. seen him. I just knew of him, and Mm-mm. being that I didn't see him before, Mm-mm. and that man was chasing me. 
I mean, my you little heart was made like, up person. He was real. And see, that's the whole thing. Like you all my real. life, all my life since I never seen him, I always thought mm-hmm. this was a, 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 mm-hmm. a, a what do they call those stories? Like a tale, like a old folk. What they call that? Tale? A, a, um, a myth. No, what do they? Not a myth, but a uh, y'all. What do they call it? Uh, not a myth, not a. But what are they true? Kind of but tale. it's not a, they. They keep bre- they they it's something they keep scary, bringing it but up. It ain't real. It's false, like pseudo, whatever they call it. But like like how they do it, like when like with the girls candy above, man uh, and all that stuff. Tell a story and it like around a campfire. They just make up stories. But no, people, he was real. He yeah. Was, but, but you know, no, I, I don't know. I I ain't, I ain't never. I, I'm, I thank God I ain't never... I can't necessarily have honestly met nobody he done that too, but I think that it was more the fact that this man was looking for acceptance in the world and he had got a bad rap for something he previously did or done or still was doing or whatever, but I can just say, I can't never say I met nobody he done that too, but I can met... I done been with a bunch of them and I done met a bunch of people. He would chase you from wherever to wherever. What they say, and I ain't never seen nobody. A lot of people say they used to chase like him across that. Adams Hill, okay. <clears throat> over there by Adams Park. It ain't you, called Adams Hill; it's called something else. But you know what I'm talking about. I don't know exactly what it's called. Park. Yeah. Oh, yeah. uh, honey, I'm gonna tell you something. Now, to this day, you probably square with because you grown, you wise. But as a kid, you like, oh uh-huh. no, player, Mm-mm. booty freaky Freddy, Mm-mm. and the man. I don't know. Where the name came from, how he got it. I don't even want but to you know what? Just like not and Let's and, and you shouldn't associate the stuff together, but the broom man, <laughs> how he <laughs> went down as a oh, legend and a man. good rest heart in and may his soul rest the in peace. The broom man. Everybody loved this man. I oh, think by the way, the broom was, man, y'all, people who live in Omaha or from here know who we talking about. But this man who made Grown made. He was like a broom. blind man. He a was blind. Good heart, a good soul. Totally blind. And he would walk up and down the street winter, summer, fall. He would get on the city bus with all his brooms. And, and everybody was, respected this man. I mean, I don't I can't and he was say blind. I ever heard of nothing. He could walk but, through the hood, through the projects, through a gang war. Wherever. And what people up, got a his way. Yep. The people would part the sea, like and buy his brooms and no damn going and buy, they home and clean up. When you talking about brooms that never bristled, that never broke down, like you buy them cheap old brooms from the store. Nowadays, I know. I remember when I first stuff be all over the place. I bought one for him one time. My broom lasted me for a long time. But what I'm they getting at with forever. him is, like, he was a positive legend, and I hate to say that. Booty Freaky Freddy was ne- more on the negative side. I don't know if it's really things that he done or what, but all I know is, honey, I'll, 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 if we gonna give if we gonna give props on anything, he kept a lot of us in shape. Yep. Cause honey, <laughs> Cause we was always you running. Would, you would think <laughs> always running. <laughs> you would think you seen him and you didn't, but you would break. You would think you somebody would break poured, camp. That was another term we used to use. <laughs> <laughs> he done broke camp. You would be like, you be like, we walking and we just talking stuff and doing our thing. You say, <laughs> girl, is that? You ain't even got, you ain't even verified. You used to be like, girl, and you just like, you better Let's go. You be put that person. <laughs> Y'all be trying to walk to the auditorium because you better get your boogie on and you looking for your who? Oh, I don't know what the new words they use now, but your cheese, your hood, your whoever you own what do at the they time. Use nowadays? I don't know. We still want cool. We gotta get back. I gotta out there. ask my kids. <laughs> and then yeah, no, no, let's ask. Some, just let's just ask some kids. Cool. We don't know. Like kids, we don't random know. Kids. Just, you know how kids are. Like I next said, time I'm at the store, I'm, so I'm gonna just stop a kid there. and be like, you know, what you call your boo? You know, you got one. My kids be lying. You need a phone. I ain't got no girlfriend. I ain't got no boyfriend. They be lying. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Let me check your phone. Let me see your phone. Uh-uh. Why? 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 Uh huh. You better, they better cut their heart out their chest and give it they to They hand you your phone. Oh, girl, that reminds me. The other day, <laughs> the other day, <laughs> my son's father, he pays for his phone bill. <laughs> he said, "Check your son's phone." He said, "You know how you know how when your kid done done something, you always say your son." Or your daughter, mm. or your child. You don't claim them when they're doing something. Or to let them do something good. Oh, that's my, my son, boy. 
He got straight A's. My, my son, son the man in the college. My son done got him a new car. You be know, like go meet the Browns when he said, let, let, how you, "What you think your son gonna do for you?" He's like, "Let me let my dad. <laughs> let me let my dad explain that part." You were like, "Hmm." Mm-mm. But, but yeah, get back to boot that the part other day. Oh, let me tell my story real quick. The other day about the phone, we was talking about kids. How you take their phone, they about die. Um, oh. he was yeah, like, check the lifeline. He was like, check your son's <laughs> phone. Make sure he ain't looking at uh biddies and stuff. I'm like, what? He said, just check his phone. Just check his phone. I'm like, okay. So my son gets home. I said, um, give me your phone. He's like, okay, here. And I was opening and scrolling through. What you looking for, Mom? I'm like, I don't know. Your dad told me to check for biddies and stuff. He said, Mom, I don't be sending pics like that. Or I said, you don't? Are you sure? Biddies, you know, biddies. Tiggle biddies. Oh, I thought it was this. Bid. <laughs> the thing. <laughs> biddies. Biddies. <laughs> Tiggle biddies. The thing. Okay, so I was looking through his phone. I, I ain't find nothing. I ain't find nothing. So I t- no, you got mad, t- huh? Like, I, you, oh, you I said, you better, you, I said, come put something on this, because I'm going to see something on this phone, While I'm boy. looking through the phone. <laughs> While I'm looking through the phone. Kids, like, I'm like, I don't see nothing. Why he, I mean, I'm thinking maybe since he paid a bill, he saw something. And I mean, it ain't like my son had time to delete or anything, because I called him when he walked in the door. Yeah. <laughs> and he was, but you know, he, he crazy. <laughs> and so, um, my son was like, I told you ain't nothing in there. I said, well, call him on my phone. And, and put something <clears throat> in your phone while you I said, it. call him on your phone, so I'm still going through his phone. He called, he don't answer. So then he calls back. No, he texts later and say, I'm at work. What's up? I said, I your son you was calling you about. The phone. I said, your son was calling you about his phone. He said, you found some biddies, huh? You found some tickle biggies. <laughs> I'm like, you know what you, 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 let me see your phone. You should have told me. My son was like. He said, that's why I'm moving out. I'm moving out. (laughs) You know, he ain't going nowhere. He's like, I'm moving out. I'm going to get me a job so I can pay my own phone bill. (laughs) But yeah. If somebody going to pay my phone bill, feel free to look in it. Oh, yeah. We were talking about kids always lying, saying they ain't got no girlfriend or boyfriend. But it was so funny because my son was like, I told you ain't nothing in my phone. And I'm like, and then his dad told me he got some big old ditties in there. He got some big old bitties in there. I'm I like, what the like, hell is wrong dry. with you? Go, go get one of your friends' phone. phone. I need phone to look at it. dry. Somebody. I'm like. I need to get somebody in trouble. Phone that's dry. <laughs> I mean, he had message in there from, like, you know, his friends, girls, guys, you know, all kind of stuff. Normal stuff. But I was like, I ain't seen nothing. It was a waste of my time. Can I get my time back? What's that lady? That, uh. <laughs> Is she a senator or something? Remember, she remember all the memes was going around. Can I reclaim my time? Can I get my time back? I was like, <laughs> can I get my time back? Cause I no, see. I can't, let me see your phone. Let me I see can't get your my time back. Phone. It was like a waste of time. I want to see somebody from some action in it. Thank you. I'm like, looking it was my phone. On there. Oh, I got a lock on mine because my son told me. I keep my son. I keep my uh, phone locked. I don't know why Just I got it on. Case. Ain't happening. But. Just in case, like they said, if you ever die or you get in a car wreck and you be in a coma or something at the hospital, and you well, know, somebody, all your business on somebody Facebook. got all your, all your, somebody get your phone, it's like, oh my God, this kill me now. This. <laughs> <laughs> Not like I keep stuff in my phone anymore. My phone, I don't know what. I mean, I, I got it. I don't do it. I don't, I don't keep nothing my in my kids. phone anymore. Just cake pictures from my customers. That's all. <laughs> all the sexy pics. Hey, hey, hey. See, you, you think you're cute. You think you're cute. We are. You think you're cool. We are. Oh, but yeah. Anywho. Oh, told you see that. Matter of fact, hold up. Wait a minute. Let me, um. Speaking of cake pics, I'm going to show y'all a picture of a cake I made today. Actually, I made this cake at like, that was a throwback pic. You know how Facebook be showing you like pictures and they, you you know, anniversary pictures. Mm -hmm. At like five this morning. I made this cake at five this morning. It's a crown. You bought it? Yep. I had to order it online. Anyway, let me see if I can get y'all to see it. Um, let's see. Internet. I need somebody to do something to my nails and my toes. 
I can't I wait to. Food. I want to get some new sandals because uh, it's I sandal it season. Be, I, don't want to take, I don't want no nails or nothing on there because I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't like clean it up. They don't look that bad. Okay, here's the picture, y'all. Let me see if I can blow it up big. <clears throat> can you see it on your phone? I want to see how big it is. What do I need to do, Tony? Just go ahead. Oh, you got it. Oh. Oh, you had it on pause. Did I? Yep, all this time. Oh, damn. The oh, stuff yeah. was coming on, man. All you gotta do is forward it all the way to the end. Oh, See? <coughs> Excuse me. This is a cake I got up and did at like 5 o'clock this morning. I baked it last night, but I got up at 5 this morning to decorate it before I had to be at the nursing home at my part-time job by 7.30. <laughs> That's what I do early in the morning while y'all sleep. <laughs> but anyway, somebody wanted a baby shower cake for a little boy. His name was Ezekiel. Ezekiel, And they wanted I it like to say, welcome Prince Ezekiel. And they wanted like a little crown on there and, you know, stuff like that. So, um, I made that for somebody this morning. I decorated it. Before the birds woke up, I was up early. <clears throat> I was so tired at work today. They was like, why do you look so tired? Because I ain't had no sleep. I'm tired. I'm tired. Tired. <laughs> tired. <She> tired. <laughs> Shoot. Decorated the cake. That's Hurry up and went and jumped in, the, jumped in the shower. Got dressed and... Hey, because you got to be down there. I got to get... Early, early morning shower. Early morning. With the Latham gig. But I like it. It's so cute. And it was, it's a, the flavor is wedding cake flavor. One time I had a strawberry wedding cake. Mm. That cake was the best thing in the world. Girl, wedding I don't cake like flavors cake like I are used to. so good. That cake I had too much smells of it. so good. It just smelled so good. Yeah, you know, you know, <laughs> that'll get you to make you want to eat it. I don't even, I don't know. I think like, it's like with anything nowadays, it got Everything tastes like the wrong thing. I don't know. I'm original, girl. You said send me to the like when it was seen to the store, and everybody want you know. Back in the day, you go to the store, you just get the same thing. You go to the store, you buying whatever you buying. Now they got fifty flavors of one thing. I'm like, uh, uh-uh. uh, uh. I ain't bringing nothing back because you ain't you gonna out. anything liquor, anything candy. You know, as kids, you got apple, grape, strawberry. Mm-hmm. Nowadays, you, I don't know, you getting banana, banana, rice, green, apple, prune, <laughs> and this one piece of candy. What the heck? <laughs> like, I don't even want that. I got all kinds of screens on here. I don't want that no more. Our words done disappeared. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, y'all. We're going to talk about so much stuff tonight. I ain't going to talk about it. But all I know is, shout out to Booty Freak. Oh, no, we ain't shout out nothing. <laughs> Hopefully, he's he's somewhere where he can't do nothing yeah, to nobody. No, yeah, he, anymore. Oh, he's retired. Is he really true? Because I still, some people say they seen him. I never seen him. I, I just, I thought I might have ran into him. But I, I broke camp. I, mm-hmm. I was kicking dust. <laughs> I don't think his sure. goal was to catch you. I just think it was more of that, you know, wh- whatever reason he actually got that I, name. Maybe that he's just scared, like just yeah. scared. And you know how, you know, like, like dang, what is that word? I know what you want to call. Like it. he wants, like people who want to scare you, and make you think they're gonna do something. They not. It's just that, like, they want to be accepted, but they know that they not. So they just use the what so they the, the like bad rap out. they really yeah, got. Yeah, yeah, they use the bad rap. <laughs> they try to live by the bad rap. Just like what was that movie? Because um, I know times I heard stories about him, good and bad, and I know more of that. You know, he tried to live up to his name and stuff like that. But it's kind of like you know how we see movies, right? And I can't remember the movie that I'm thinking of, but you guys might can help me out in the chat. Or you might remember, but it's a movie and um somebody in the house in the neighborhood, all the kids were scared of. They thought they was a witch or thought they was a monster or 
murder yeah, or something yeah. like that. And, and so, so we the were... person in the house would play off of it. So when they see the kids coming, they were like, Rawr! or they were like, yeah, you yeah, know, like it's trying a to scare them. No and more then they so, go so in the grass. house, right? Then you find out later down in the movie that that person is like the sweetest person in the whole world, and they just got tired of people. What's that one? You know? New York, uh, the boy. Macaulay Cook. You talking about Home Alone? And remember the man lived next door, and they said they the the uh the man that lived next door. He was dragging his trash can. And they said that oh, he put dead bodies yeah, in there. Yeah, that like that, man, like that, right? Yeah, like yeah. something like that. But like come they to find ain't really bad. Like that, yeah. Right, they ain't really bad, but they got that reputation, so. They just make people think they biggie bad. Like they sometimes I think it's a good or bad rap, but sometimes now that any anytime you better, you know, yeah, it's, it's up to you how you take it. Because sometimes like people they don't who pretend be a to be in a gang, like these people on these <laughs> these inner these new age entertainers and rappers and stuff. They all gang members. Everybody in the gang. Everybody grew up in the gang. They own they little C D rapping about I came shoot right them up, there, bang, and I know bang, I wasn't in the gang. And they I won't bust a great. They won't Me. bust a great. But but <laughs> well, they got but. people thinking that they're gang they members. Hardcore. But you see them in person and you threaten them, they better took all behind their bodyguard. Well they what beat they self out of wet paper bag. Where the base? Where the base? <laughs> It's a breeze. <laughs> Somebody give me <laughs> security. Somebody stole my mic. <laughs> they been full on a where Craig and Dad at? Huh, the, huh, <laughs> on the real security. <laughs> oh my god, that's one of my favorite shows. Ooh, I can't wait till uh last Friday come out. When you know we gonna go see that? They've been working on it for a minute. Last Friday. Yes, it's gonna last be the last. Friday. The last. I mean, um, what do they call? Hold up. Okay, there's Where Friday. There's Friday, Friday. There's Friday. There's next Friday. There's Friday, Friday after the next. next. This one's gonna be called Last oh, Friday. My Lord, that's what it's called. Last uh-huh. Friday. I'm exhausted now. I ain't so I'm sure the show's gonna start off like a little, little something like, okay, so this is what happened last week, and it's gonna be like. You know, the which one the line. original Friday, the first Friday when she Friday. said, "That's the one I like." Half dead. What's she Come say? on, sister. I said, "Huh? How you mad?" Cause he was oh, when he was old, oh, like the. Then when he came through, he was like, "What's up?" And I, I never do that to him. I just uh-uh. don't answer. Like, okay, let you me know tell we you was trained as children not to do that to you. But let me tell you something. Not okay, you know I work from home during the daytime, right? So sometimes if I if, if I get a knock, it's either the mailman trying to get me to sign for something because I be ordering stuff, you know, for, you know, different reasons, my cakes and whatnot. And so I'll answer the door. Sometime they'll knock and I'll look out and I don't see nobody. Then I'm like, I don't see no truck. I don't see no car. But I hear knocking. And then I just wait. And be peeping out the window, and I see them walking away all suited up, necktie, white shirt, fresh, uh, shiny black shoes, <laughs> um, a Bible in the left side, a track in the right side. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, oh, no, no, no. Hurry up and shut the curtains. <laughs> Hurry up and shut the curtains. Be hiding. You know how people be hiding on next to the wall, next to the curtain, like they can <laughs> see you, but you be hiding. <laughs> Just in case they can That's see through the of, curtain. I mean, it's 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 good, but it's not good because I, I don't remember know. what my mom used to say. I go to church. You better open my door. I mean, and I go to church. You like, well, I have my belief. I have my religion. I go to church. I praise the Lord. I, I play, play with. I put money cause... in the offer plate. Uh, maybe not as much <laughs> as they want me to, but I do put something in the offer. <laughs> Wait. I'm gonna put you out. <laughs> don't try to put me out the church now. I'm gonna, uh-uh, no, don't, don't try to put me out the church I'm gonna, now. I'm gonna put you out. Hey, like I put your son I, I, out, I, 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 You know that song, thing. "Give It in Jesus' Name." I give it in Jesus' name. <laughs> it might not be as much as somebody wants me to give <laughs> all the time, but I give it in Jesus' name. That the Lord. Oh, I know what I do. I give it and I be happy, and now, that's what I was told. What? So if you gonna give it, give, give it, it whole and be happy. Yep. If you don't, if you be like, dang, I gotta then keep it. 
That's just like lending money you know? to people. Like, how many times we hear people, I didn't loan them some money and they ain't never paid me back. And woo, 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 I'm about to whoop they butt. And woo, 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 woo. Like, I know somebody, for example, I ain't gonna say their names because she's one of my uh, subscribers and we are like in real life friends. So I'm not gonna say her name, but I'm gonna use the story. It's in not her me. situation, in her situation, I would do exactly what she did. Somebody I know had lent somebody some money, a lot of money, like thousands. And skip. And they lent them thousands of dollars. I, I can't remember why the, the person hell? did it. But the person was a friend of theirs for like umpteen she years. Friend, like, no, you didn't do Kelly Price on me. <laughs> she was a friend of mine. <laughs> she did. You can't come over here with a little dead time. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna be having this on Saturday. No, okay. Anyway, um, I'm she knew her for umpteen years. <laughs> it's just a little slower. Than that. She knew her for umpteen years. So you know, when you have a relationship like that, that hurts. She though. she saw her all the time. They talked on the phone all the time. They inbox text money, chatted y'all. up all they the don't. time. They hung out all the time. As soon as she lent her that money. What is that? Who the who? Where they at? Where they at? Hey, where they at? Where they at? Hey. <laughs> Just disappear. <laughs> Just disappear. What they say vanish with Vanish a... in the thin air without a trace, honey. That's it. Without a trace. <laughs> I mean, my homegirl was calling the girl, texting her. You know, you said Don't you were going to call me in. I'm calling back. Basically, so he much said, well, time. what I got a new phone stuff. See, when so we was coming time. up, we couldn't lie like that, Tanya. And it was most of the time she was calling her like anybody who's probably ever loaned somebody some money. Even when you know they still owe you some money, they you still cool with them. And you might just be calling them, hey, you want to go out this yeah. weekend? Hey, have you seen that movie? Hey, what's up with you? You know how it's work? Hey, how your mama doing? How your kids doing? You know you I just want to talk. Borrow money, though, because I, I, you I, I, I want to give it back. Had a relationship I know how like it is. that. People get your cheese and they don't get it back. Then you wanna... That girl was dodging her like a dodgeball. That girl Lord was dodging God. her like a crackhead. That girl was dodging her. <laughs> this woman that said a crack. If she died like crackhead. You already know she won't catch you. You died to her like a crackhead. She like he stole you. something. <laughs> like like he stole something. You know a crackhead be. Oh, you know. You ever seen that movie with uh, Rock, the Roxanne Shante movie? Yes. I was just talking remember about it on my channel the other remember day. Remember when the mama had the boyfriend and she took, showed him all the money that she was going to use for mm-hmm. the move out of the project and he. I, f- I didn't see the, all money, of it, and she ended gone. up letting, huh? That money was gone. She let him do something, and he posted me came, and then they all ready to move, and he didn't show up. Uh, what's the mama? Like? She's so pretty. I, guess, I She's haven't so seen that movie yeah, in a long people. time. Yep. I can't remember if remember, he smoked it. He never he showed back up the it, next day. Remember? He, I can't remember what he did with it. Oh, did he, he, I know he I know didn't They didn't end up moving. No, they didn't move. That hurt in my heart because you know, as a child coming from where I was going see out stuff there like that. rapping for money. And she yeah. Said, yeah. But yeah, so my friend's homegirl, my homegirl's friend, should I say, uh, she was dodging her and everything. And it, so much time had went by. And it's like, okay, now you don't want to talk to me at all. I'm just calling to kick it with you, chop it up, chit chat. People mad at you about and, your money, though, Tanya. Like, you I know. Something. Well, you like, didn't do like something because you, you look, But you know what? Like you owe them. Well, look at it like this, though. You did do something. When you lost somebody your money, and you, you, they they, they tell you they, they 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 come off like like give if you loan me some money, I'm gonna give it back. You know that off the top, cause I ain't going nowhere. Yeah, some people that you okay. But, I'm not gonna act like I'm not gonna act like but, I ain't never borrowed. From nobody before. No, but, but when you do, you pay back. But if I say I'm paying t- you Friday on payday, I'm paying you Friday on. Pay- I don't care right. who don't get paid. You, you get yours. I'm gonna make sure that person that loaned me ten or twenty or whatever it was back in the day get they money. They got their money because you ain't gonna never say Tanya owes you anything, right? Or that I didn't pay you back because I own you after you don't pay me. You can't burn all your bridges, but I this own shit, you. She burned all her bridges. She wouldn't I want call you her. Not to pay me. Wouldn't answer the phone. And so my homegirl ended up suing her and took her to court. The girl didn't show up to court. The judge granted her 
the money, and everything. But not the court. She can't find her. Not the court. So not she took court. her to court. She took her to court. Not took her to small claims court. What? Showed him all the taxes, the exchange, you know. Can I That's borrow? That's why one thing, all the text learned, messages though, and everything. Remember from watching the court shows? That. Just Judy. When you get on there, don't talk about something. It's a gift. And, when, you know, because, you know, I've been around people. And, and I don't have people come back after they broke. Your receipts. And they... <laughs> The keep, receipts keep your get receipts. You. The receipts will get you. But one <laughs> thing is, I have, I, and it's not necessarily been me, but I done been in a relationship when, when people went, you know, when you get money, don't lie. I don't care if you get money all the time, but you get some money and and, and you say, oh, it changes a little bit in there, but I don't care if you used to getting money. Like you people who get their taxes. Oh, yeah. And they get like six, seven, eight thousand dollars and be broke in two weeks. But but during the time that they get job, this money, they, they want to take me and you out to new. eat. Oh, you go to the mall. Girl, go and get that purse or them shoes. They hood oh, yeah, rich. Cause, yeah, that, thank you. Say it again. Hood rich. But then when they broke, they want to say, remember, I bought you some shoes and we went to Chatters and we went to. Red Lobster, you like what well, they don't ask them to do. Yeah, but Stop then ain't to do. no record of it from you ordering them. But then they want to come texting your phone or, or, or even your kids' phone. Thomas will tell your mama, "I'm gonna need my I phone." I need a holler. Yeah, or, or, or they put your kids in it. But they only usually do that when they done spent all their money. Right. And then it's like, but oh, during man, the time they rich and they own. up here, so. I got my own. I got my own. Same way you feeling when your pockets are swollen. Feel like if that it ain't when my they, birthday, they came down or something like that. You know, or it's like um, we celebrating some achievement that I've got, and you want to take me out. Otherwise, if we going out, I might I pay got this my time. Own. You pay this time. I pay this time. You pay this time. Or we just pay for ourselves. Oh, I just sneak out. I'm just playing. <laughs> I'm gonna go to the bathroom. I pay. I pay. <laughs> I'm just laughing. I ain't washing nobody I'm dishes. I'm joking. Look, I ain't getting look, this bag. Look, I know. I, I'm I not pay. washing nobody dishes. Cause me, nope. I'm always the one that be like, ma'am, ma'am, and then you know my name is Sam. It ain't ma'am, <laughs> so I gotta make my body keep going. No, I wouldn't. I, 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 I can't stand you. I'm too scared. I always be the one that be there. They had cash. I don't want to go to jail for no twelve ninety nine bill. Really, for real. And then, then I call my dad, and be like, "Daddy, Daddy, mm-hmm. I told you, I done told you." Mm-mm-mm. But you look at who come to the door. My daddy, <laughs> my daddy. <laughs> <laughs> like, but no, I always no. say, and you know. But one thing is though, your dad is you, cool as heck though. If you take somebody somewhere and your money, if you got five hundred dollars. What they call it? A monetary blessing. Say mm-hmm. you get it and you ain't gotta come up. Everything everything paid for. We talking hood it. terms here. And you take somebody out. <laughs> nice I'll tell you gonna take somebody out that you hanging with or whatever or your sister or somebody. But don't whoever. throw it back up in their face. But when the money gone is gone, y'all that ate, y'all that bought a few things. That's petty. Don't throw you it know? back up in their face. Ain't nobody told you to uh splurge all like a lot of these people who's rich and famous, they go broke by just, oh, I have this money. I have to spend it on people. No, I you to. don't, baby. I have to buy them a house. I have to buy them five cars. I have to pay their cars. Because when I win the lottery, tuition. I'm going to give you something to you, but I ain't promising you. A... Girl, I'll be happy with $100. That's more than what I have. Now, but see. then you do got to take me to Jamaica so I can get my groove back. Oh, my God. I want to go where Stella went. Okay. I want to go where Stella went. I I don't want to go to no Waikiki. I don't want to go to no Honolulu. Mm -hmm. I don't want to go to no... Stella got a groove back, man. I want to go where Stella went. We want to know. Stella Stella got a groove back. I want me some dark chocolate. Well, we ain't never lost the groove. They got the best chocolate (laughs) over there. Like, the best chocolate. This woman that said... They got the best... You know I like it. You you already know. What see what this, chocolate see this phone. Is it dark chocolate? See this phone. All chocolate. Oh, no, matter of fact, see this shirt. Oh, cho- What's milk chocolate see is my what hair. I like. See my hair? No, I don't want that blood. I man. like it. Fool around, all I got to do is keep it. Because then I'm going to have to keep them smiling so I know where location is at. 
don't want, I don't want them too black now. I like them black like my daddy. No, that's Lord. funny. That's funny because I swear, I swear to God, you gotta keep, you I gotta swear keep, on my mama. Like, I, I swear on my mother who's up in heaven praying for me when I go to heaven. I swear on my mother who's up in heaven praying for me right now. Miss Velvet Cake. That's what we gonna call Miss Velvet Cake. Who's praying? Yes, Miss Velvet Cake. That my mama would put her foot in some cakes. My mama would put her. Put in some cakes, Lord Jesus. Hey, See, that's birthday, where I got though? it from. But oh, remember girl. the birthday? It was like if y'all want to make you another red velvet cake. And what happened when she called? She was like, "My mom be like, she said, know what the red? What kind, <laughs> what kind of cake you want? What kind of cake y'all you want just, me to bring? I don't even know. Cause I'm she like, a red velvet. Red velvet. <laughs> that was fire. But yeah, so um, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. anyway, I was dating this guy. And he was really dark skinned, like really like dark skin. And her. one night we were sitting around the house and I was in my bedroom and my boyfriend was in the living room watching TV and I must have came out of there and the, I'm looking around calling his name, calling his name. Where you. you at? Where you at? Call his name. That's call almost cause us having my sisters. Y'all know what bathroom, she's talking about. Like, I when do. The I basement, was upset. When the basement. I'm a, then, next thing I know, I hear a voice. So you just gonna act like you don't see me. If she keep on, I'm a, I'm I a, a, like, I'm a unfriend her. I was like, I'm you know, friend, I'm again, back to, oh, a a back to black folks, the stereotype, when we hear something out the blue and we up. get scared, we just break. <laughs> I'm telling you, I was like, and it was like, it was all deep. So you just go sit there and act like you don't see me. I'm like, she keeps oh, lying, I, turn, she to get I out. turn, next thing I saw is white. And I saw white teeth. And I saw white teeth. Well, I was like, I, I got tied in the chain and so I'm losing. So I when, I say, little lighter. when I say <laughs> I, when I say I fell out, I was crying a river. I was laughing so hard I was crying, and he was sitting there just steaming. It ain't even that funny. It ain't even that funny. It ain't even that funny. <laughs> I, almost, I was hollering. I, put her ass I was out of here. hollering. I was hollering. Samantha, that I was the funniest. Know. I know. That was, yeah, we told you that story. They used to come over our house all the time. We used to kick it. We used to kick it. Our house was always like the kicking spot. Either our house or your I'm house. Gonna, I'm gonna your talk house about used to much. be the kicking spot too. I'm gonna talk. Oh, we about to be having it. All. I'm like, Mm-mm. we gonna move. We're this, saying we're gonna move We grilling. What you got on the grill? We we bring the steaks. The hood table. The I the bones. Yes, I was just talking about today. As soon as it get nice, we're going to move the hood table to the patio. Oh, we should get us a nice table. Yes, we should. You know, get some get nice get night table. lights and some hang and hang some little. Nah, no pa- we I, have a I patio got somebody set, perfectly who can hook up the backyard. You know, Greg, <laughs> he's on Facebook. The, the guitar dude, they call him the bass man. Mm-hmm, but we can get him. Yes, yes, he does that. He does landscaping, all that, lights and all that. I, I need, yeah, I got a man for my grass. But he an awesome. He, he been my the grass man all up for in the trees. Years. He hang him on the roof. On I said I want to do all that, and I think we should. I think it'll give us more of a social thing for the just family and stuff. Hat. And anybody just can't walk up on the yard. You know that. For the way that's, why like so that's why I like patios. I love the summertime because I love being And I really don't care for outside, but the patio, this man that did our patio, he did an awesome job. I don't I know his it. name. I love Somebody it. found him for me. They patio is lit. Like, you can fit, like, a hundred-some people on her patio. And I, and I normally don't <laughs> like to go outside, but I said, I'm going to oh, start enjoying it. When you have some nice there, mm-hmm. like I said, when we go shopping... We gonna try to find like a nice little patio set. I was thinking, should we put a rug or something on it, or what should we do? Not necessarily a rug because well, we are we in April and I'll be ready to do it in May as soon as I get back on. I'll be on as soon as I get off like the plane, so I'll be already. Something that's like waterproof. Should we get a rug or no? Nah, nah, nah just leave it like this so we sweep it up and yeah. move the furniture. Mm-hmm. And in the winter time, take the stuff in. No, I in the winter time, we need to get a fire pit. 
You already got a fire. I don't want the thing. Yeah, we need a new fire. Go, I'm, I'm saying we it, like I done moved in. I I'm, I'm well, taking well, over her. Like I'm yours. taking over her patio. No, that's cool. I, she gonna right. wake up in the middle of the night. I'm be sitting outside like oh, in that God. movie. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna be like, there's somebody uh, out there uh, it's a, who it's looks a family like me. I said look like us. It's gonna be me and my kids oh, just like, sitting there oh. holding hands, just like in the movie. <laughs> That's the best doing that for you. I was like, huh? I was like, me, you love looking at the that screen. That was like one of the scenes where I was scared. Like, uh-huh. That it was, was like one of the I scenes was scared, where I was scared. But I was like, what the? I guess because how we came up, you like not that you was because none of the people came to your house. Unannounced, mm-hmm. and they came like a unit. You're like, oh, stuff about to get real. Mm-hmm. So now I said to somebody, I'm gonna say, where, where my shoes at? Thank you, Miss Lady Scoop. What my brother? <laughs> oh, they felt like we were talking to you. Oh no, she said nice cake. I missed her. I missed her comment. I forgot to click back on the comments. I'm sorry. We just up here talking. Just, yeah, <laughs> we done been on here like two hours. We just talked. We done went we from. Gonna get some, we gonna get the patio together, and y'all gonna be out there with us on a, on the hood table, yep. and we gonna be just, we just about to do big things. Yeah, and it's gonna stay positive, and if, and, and, yeah, and if stay anything positive. bothers anybody, don't report us. Talk to us, you know, because that ain't our intentions. We we here just to we our our aim, our aim is to team. entertain. Not to, yeah. It's to entertain. That's, that's it. We aim to entertain. And that's what that's, we going to do. That's what it's going to be. We real. We down to earth. We a little cray cray. We good we people. Dance. We honest people. That's all we doing to try to. What we, we not try what we going to do. What we going to do. We'll have fun. On we the gonna YouTube. Eat. We gonna exercise. Mm-hmm. We gotta do some we mukbangs. Do, do some mukbangs. We might take it. You know what I need to take out? Change um, that name. I don't know. No, I'm gonna screen name, uh, Tanya. I need, um. Oh, my screen Oh, we gotta do. Yeah, I'm gonna show you how to do that. Mm-hmm. But my, uh, my stick, the, uh, selfie stick. When we I like. in my bathroom. I got two of them, but we never used them. Me when me. my son had went to college, um, a few years back, when he was out of town at college, they gave that to us for like a, you know, make sure y'all come to the college. No, with they bag. No, he was already signed up and everything. It it was like oh, they gave you a bag of pens and pencils and, and whatever. Some of them, you know, they're like gift, they little gift stuff? bags, little you know. No, no, like the celebrities, they put houses and cars. Yeah, and, like they and stuff in the bag. <laughs> stacks. <laughs> they put stacks. Yeah, when you go to a celebrity party, you get they, you might get some car keys, like mm. ten thousand. You might get some really expensive person. No helping them pay their child support or they a, vaca- a vacation home. Um, <laughs> I said a no paying their child support. But yeah, so but I know what you mean. Like when you go there to get like the water yeah, bottles, gave, yeah, it was water bottles. And, and, yep, yep. He had t shirts, oh, all that stuff. We using all that. Yep. Hats and everything, and they gave each of us a selfie stick, and I've never used it before. But like sometimes when I be out and about and I be doing my live, I gotta hold my phone Mm-mm. in my hand Mm-mm. like this. And don't I don't you got a thing in your window? No, I'm talking about when I'm walking. If I'm out walking and, and I want to go live, movie that night when we went to see that movie. Oh. <laughs> See, that's what I was talking about then. Remember, I said I wish I had a selfie stick so I could put us both in the uh-uh. she uh-uh. didn't. She didn't want to be on camera. She was like, uh uh-uh, uh, not today. <laughs> not today, asshole. No, it wasn't. Get, get me. I, I don't want to like, be on. What, what, I don't want to be on live. I don't want to be on what live. What are we doing? Now, see, the night the man stayed behind me, y'all, uh, he got this big old floodlight. It don't even be no rain, no bad weather. Is that weather, the humongous nothing. house, or is that the one, the humongous house over that way? This is you know more, the one we more. used to go trick or treat. It's up here. Yeah, that house is with the huge. cast iron gates and stuff. That house is so huge. Like, yeah. I'm I used to walk when I used to be doing my walking, and I come back home. One day, that 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 tell you that you can't overcome your fears if you tired, and some uh, every other day that'll make you. Upset, and you be like, uh uh-uh, uh, I ain't about to go that way. But when I used to do my walks and I come back home, my feet hurt, and I'm trying to get to the house. These people up, this, up here got this dog, and it used to be oh, outside. Yeah, they did have a big dog. And it'll come to the edge of the thing one day. I knew it. I said, I, You know, when they say, 
enough is enough. <laughs> that dog. I Did see you fight the dog? No, I see it tried to the end of the thing. And my feet said something like, go on to the house. <laughs> that dog came down there. I stopped. I said, let me tell you. You don't want it today. <laughs> I don't know what, but that dog looked at me, and I looked at it, and he I was like, his uh, it, went, his it, went, it went back up to his house He's like, on real. I was like, not today. <laughs> I, normally, I'd be like, let me he cross the street. He was like, and I knew he was, <laughs> and I knew he was going to be there. I looked, I said, uh-uh, baby. He was like, I did, I looked at it, I was like, not today, Scooby. Not today. It was high, and I I was like, uh-uh. You know, you you, you, you ain't even got it in you, but like just to go home. You huh. like, my house is like, folk, a few houses down. Do you think I'm going to go over here? Uh-uh. It took me enough. I said, no. I told her, Doug, I said, not today. <laughs> the not devil the is day. a lie. Mm-hmm. The, and that dog, no light, y'all. That dog looked at me, and I looked at it. Like, how they say, stand your ground? I was on the sidewalk. I was like, you, you saw him. And he Y'all went back up. To, he up. went back up that driveway. Like, uh, uh-uh, this a fool right here. I ain't messing with her. I was tired. I said, let me tell you something. I looked at the door. I said, not today. <laughs> I took that earphone thing. I remember. I I remember my feet was I like, I oh. I wish I could. I seen walked that. down and I didn't see it at first. But when you get down there, you have face. She said, you were like, mm, My hair just I ain't, I ain't leaving. I ain't leaving. That dog looked at me. I said, not today. That dog went back up that, up that driveway. I don't know where it went. I came on to the house. So I said, it's too much. It was hot. Mm-mm. I was tired. I said, oh, Lord, no. Not today. Mm-mm. Not today. That dog was, I said, mm. That, and from then on, if it was outside, if it was in the driveway, it stayed right in the spot. No lie, it stayed right in that spot. Because he knew you then, he was like, okay, hey, I can't bark at her. Go she on, ain't going to be scared. She going to, mm-mm. Because I think I, I, don't know, but, <laughs> I don't know what, but you know, I don't know what. I, I was like, and as I got by, I was like, what the hell? <laughs> I did to myself like, what the world? Oh but I was God. like, you ever know that you that that's like that bully at your school or somewhere at your somewhere you when you had enough you, you had enough zone. you just gotta get it out the way. I was like, yep. cause every day I was always think about this dog and I was like that day I don't know if I was on the phone or what but I remember I had the earphones in and I don't know what it got off my because usually when I got down there I go across and go around that that what they call that thing in the road the fork in the road. The fork. I go the other what you know go all, go all the way over there. I'm like this day I I must have been running my mouth or listen or deep in something. I said not today. Like, uh-huh. I said, you better, you better, not today. Not today. I don't look. I look. It look. I'm like yeah. You gonna get it. You gonna either. Get, I'm gonna get it. Or you gonna get it. <laughs> I don't know why everybody oh like God. that. Like when you oh finally com- you confront your bully, it's basically I was like, y'all better go. Mm, head on, head on. I mean, I wasn't gonna do that because I want Peter, or whoever. You know, I ain't gonna never be doing that to no animal because I love my little son Jerome. But I was just like, not today. You want to go back because I ain't running. Mm-hmm. You can walk me on to the house. I a dog though. If he, if he, if he, you know, if he a real big dog, though, I'm going to just have to run. Last time, If though, he a real big dog. I'm gonna, but if a dog came up on me, like. I that lady at the park that morning. Now, we outside oh, in the man. dark. I thought I was going to take her down. I ain't going to lie. I'm just going to tell him something. Pet him. I don't want to pet your dog. I don't, I. I, I, I don't do nothing. Yeah, she just told me. I went I, Girl, you better go. This lady, man, we walk together in the summertime, me and her. It's dark. And dude. Why you sometimes in Sometimes we bed? get up early in the morning before the sun comes up. Sometimes we just get up and go. Hey, you woke, you woke, let's go walking. Yeah. Um, This lady was in the park. And With she a had horse this dog. dog that was so big. And she was up there. She kept trying to. <laughs> The dog kept trying to come to us, and we like, uh, uh-uh, uh, let's go, let's go. She got a dog, let's go, let's go. That thing's big. While we trying to move it right along, she kept, no, 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 here, here, look, look. He don't bite. Let him look, do look, this. Let him. I don't uh, know. Nope. Girl, with you better than head. Put your hand in his mouth. He won't bite you. You know. Do- I was like, ain't nobody trying to mess with that dog. I said, Not lady, me, baby. Um, most people who get bit, it was by a dog that didn't bite. 
But no, not my and dog. My got, dog. I'm when well, I say I still got one on my she leg. was dang near getting combative and arguing with us because we did not want to pet her big old And I like look girl, looking, you better down Cujo mm-hmm. looking yeah. dog. Like you got Cujo on a leash and you can barely hold him. And you talking about, oh, just pet him. Just- Even when men was outside in the morning, men that, I mean, not that because it was a man, but like we, like I had all kind of encounters, especially walking like that in parks and I hate wherever. Dogs that men are loose. was, you would tell them, you know, and they would get their dog. I done had a man put his dog, he said, they would wrap the leash around them and put them in their car. To, yeah, but this yeah. woman, like, uh uh-uh, uh, touch it, touch it, he nope. don't bite. Yeah, I said, you know what? All people say that about their dogs. Um, and then until they bite them, and then it's like, oh, oh, don't sue me, don't sue me. Oh, yeah, no. the same person. I have a friend, a very good friend of mine, and we go back to we go way back, raise our kids together. And she had a pit, and we had never seen this dog before because she had moved, Ooh, I had moved, you know, yeah. life went on, and then we came together for a birthday party that she invited us to for one of her children. <laughs> and they had a dog, and it was a pit. Me, anybody, anybody who knows me will tell you: if you got a pit at your house, you got a rock, you got anything like that at your house, Tanya is not coming over unless you lock the thing in the basement, lock it in the garage, or something like that. My own sis, D, she used to have a big old, big old pit, and they called the pit was it blue. It was something. This pit was so huge. And every time I went over there, sis, I'm not coming in. Nope. Take that dog. Lock it up in the garage. Okay? Now I'm over to my friend's house and she's like, like, "Um, I doing that. My friend at the party was telling everybody, oh, yeah, the kids can pet the dog. He can pet the dog. They ain't, they, the dog ain't gonna bite. The dog ain't never been nobody. The dog is trained. The dog, you know, the dog, the dog, the dog. So, everybody, all the kids (laughs) petting the dog. Hey, dog, now I'm watching because I'm like, I'm terrified. I'm watching. I got my eye on the dog. And my kids over there, too. I got my eye on the dog. All the kids walk by, pet the dog, smile, laugh. Soon as my oldest son did exactly what the other kids was doing. Reached out the pet and hey, doggy, that dog must have reached out and gripped his hand and took a chunk out of his hand. Everybody started panicking, running around looking for bandages. I mean, the boy was bleeding all over, crying and snotting and everything. <laughs> when people tell you the dog has never bit anybody and our dog don't this like the first time for everything. Not ever believe that. I never, I never believe that stuff. Mm-hmm. No, my son almost needed stitches. And then, thank God, my friend had just had his uh, shots, had his rabies, had she had all the paperwork. So we did not have to take him and um, submit him to, yeah, they sticking him and poking him and stuff, you know, for rabies and all that kind of stuff. So thank God they had him up to date. But yeah, that that literally, and he was probably about, I want to say 12 or 11 then. And I mean, I knew before then that you shouldn't listen to people who say, my dog don't bite, my dog don't bite. But after that, that's when it's solidified for me. to annoy you. Mm-mm. Anything, he trying to take my anybody. son's hand hey, yeah. off, and then I was so pissed because my uh, my sons, both of them, play sports all the time, all year round, till they're darn near graduated. So it was like he played sports, he played football, he played basketball. He needs his hands to play sports. Yeah, and his hand was—I mean, it took a while to heal up. It took a while to heal up. So anywho. Anybody who tells you my dog don't bite, tell them they can go where the sun don't shine. Because, <laughs> but that lady really was trying to get us to pet mm-mm, her dog. Mm-mm. I'm like, listen, lady, shoot, we don't want to touch a dog on dog. Get your dog away from me. Put your dog on the chain and get your dog away from me. I was hot. I was like, oh my god, that lady was. I think she had some issues. Mm-mm. I think she had some. No, I'm serious. I think she has some issues. Mm-mm-mm. But anyway, y'all. Anyway, we done been on here. Oh, Lord. We done went over the mm-hmm. two-hour mark. <laughs> oh, Lord Jesus. Well, we talked about a lot of stuff. We told y'all a few hood stories. Um, and we did review uh, the movie Us. Sam gave it a five. 
Um, I, I gave it a zero. six. Now she says she's giving it a zero. <laughs> I'm just saying, <laughs> y'all. I gave it a six. <laughs> um, anybody who comes in later rewatches the video, let you can know. always let us know in the comment section what score you gave this movie or how you felt about the movie or what meaning you got out of the movie. Mm -hmm. I want to end it right here, Sam, with us telling what we really, what the, what they, what we think they tried to make us see. Like, what do you think was the message for you? Well, the overall thing I think they're trying to make us see is, first of all, keep an eye on your kids if you're taking them somewhere to an amusement park or any, anywhere in general, but also with the girl being replaced by the other one that was in the house already, I think that by them going back there every year, since the one that was the original girl that was, that the original girl that was left in the mirror house, I think the girl that the, the girl that got away or whatever, she was trying to, she, she was, I don't think she was afraid that she put off to me, but she probably felt something or she knew something. And that's why she wanted to leave before the family showed up, but they got kind of caught there. And I think that, um, it was a, a right movie, but it was kind of like, I don't know. They should have just kind of stuck to like one main thing is, Instead of having all these other people in there, they could have just stuck with the little girl that was in the house and got switched. And, and they could have explained a little more why the girl wasn't talking because the one that was, the one that got, the one that wasn't talking when, you know, when they switched places or whatever, she wasn't talking because I think that she hadn't been out in the real world. But either way, I think mm -hmm. overall that it was okay, but they could have done a lot better with just sticking to just them Instead of bringing all these other people, having this big old line to go around the whole park and everything, which some people that was just, uh, they was basically just holding hands. There was no purpose really for them in the movie. There was just like extras as they call them, I guess. But yeah, <clears throat> it get me. better and things go on, and we 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 got this. I think it's okay. Yeah. Um. Urban legends. That's what they yeah, call them. That's what that's we were trying. Yeah. That's what we were trying to think of uh, before about people telling stories, um, <clears throat> like people telling stories, and they they meant to kind of be like a message in the story, but sometimes the story can be scary, like somebody did something really horrible, yeah, and it keeps getting passed down and passed down and passed down. But that's what we were trying to think of earlier. Um, I think. Uh, for me, um, I think the message mainly for me, and 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 mind you, I still don't fully understand the movie. Like, mm -hmm. like yeah, okay, when the lady had at the end, when we realized <laughs> that when the little girl, when the first original little girl first got caught in the mirror um, house in the fun house, she. Like they told the story later in the movie. In in the beginning of the movie, well, all through the movie till it got to the end, they made you think or believe that the little girl who went into the fun house was came that... right back out the mm -hmm. fun house. Yeah. Like she was the same exact little girl, but they made us believe that something horrible happened to this little girl. And that's why the the parents was panicking, like, something happened to her. What would we do? She don't talk anymore. She don't do this. She's not the same little girl. She was not the same little girl. What had happened was, when she went into the fun house and went down all them steps and on the escalator and all this, you know, down um, to almost hell, uh, the little girl, her double, because remember we said earlier on that down below the earth, there is a double of everybody, like our exact twins who want to get out and want to live out here in the world with us, but they can't because they're like trapped down there for some reason. So the little girl, she went down there and her double was the one who actually went back out to the girl's parents. Right. And the little girl who initially went in the fun house, they had tied her down and um, tied her, because she had a fight with the double. She had a fight with the bad little girl, 
you know, and the little girl, they tied her up, tied her to the bed or something, and she was screaming and trying to, you know, get loose to go back to her parents, but the bad little girl took off her clothes. <laughs> she oh, took yeah. off her clothes, the double, the bad double. She took off her clothes, um, gave them to the girl and put the little girl's clothes on, and so when she went back up, out the fun house and to her parents. That's why we thought it was the same girl. Right. Because she was dressed like the little girl who initially went in there. And so after we realized that, then we realized that the mama, that the kids was raised with the, the lady who had the kids, who had the husband, who had, um, you know, all this. She wasn't even the real little girl. The lady who we assumed had grew the one up. That, that talk. Wonder, yeah, the, the and now we know why. Talk. Now I know why she didn't. Um, well, you know, after that is when I realized why she really didn't want her son to go into the fun house because I think he would have saw his mama. You know, mm-hmm. the the not his mama, but a lady who looks like his mama, which was like should have been his real mother. It's kind of confusing if you didn't watch it. But anyway, the little girl went in. Her double, the mean little demon child, Mm -hmm. she came out. She met a guy. She had a family. She had kids. So at the end of the movie, when the little boy realized that his mama should be living down below the earth, he remember when they looked at each other? Yeah, yeah. He realized she wasn't the right person. He realized that my mama's double that we killed was the original little girl that had got lost and trapped in the mirror house. So my message was just basically that I got was that there are probably people around this world who are less fortunate than others. Um, We all might look the same. We might laugh the same. Hmm. We might, you know, dream the same. But some of us are just so less fortunate and really wish we could do some of these things and other people have these things and they take it for granted when there's really somebody else in this world who wants to be like you. Not necessarily like you, but would love to be in a position where they don't have to worry about bills, where they have a car where they have a home where they you know because the people under the ground they were doing exactly what the people oh, were yeah. doing above ground but they didn't have it like like remember when they was driving cars like the people above ground you know on earth was driving cars it would be their double underground mimicking they driving like they're really driving like <laughs> turning the wheel leaning back and cut you know what i'm saying that was but they ain't got no car me, they just sitting there pretending like they driving you know so they were doing like the people who were swimming in the beach the people underground yeah, they, they were like, like yeah but yeah that's acting like the girl they was all into it like they <sighs> i didn't get that either <laughs> and I'm like, hold up, what? But I don't know, that's that's all I could get out of it. But it was like, I didn't get it because my thing was, in the very end, if that mother who mm-hmm. met a husband who had kids, if she was really the little child that was living in the fun house, in the bottom of the fun house, why wasn't she as mean and evil as the other people from the fun house who were coming out to kill everybody? I don't know. Because the woman who originally, the little girl who originally went into the fun house, she became the evil person. Yeah. Like the rest of those voice, people yeah. around. Like the rest of the people. Boy. And then when they had, at the end, when remember what I said, we are the world. <laughs> oh, you remember the, uh, the video, we are the world. That was like one of my favorite all time videos. Holding everybody to, holding hands. And it looks line. like everybody is stretched out all over the earth. And we're all connected, holding hands, you know. That's how it was at the end of the show with all the doubles, the bad double people who was trying to kill the real people to take over their lives. And that's basically what they was doing. They was trying to take over their lives, live their lives, have their homes, have their cars, (laughs) have their boats, have their money, have their jobs. That's what it was about. And I think it was mainly appreciate what you got. Because everybody did have a twin. Like the people. Everybody had a twin. The best house ever. The Everybody. It was crazy. Nice Everybody had a twin <laughs> up in there. And they all were trying to kill the original people. So, yeah. Um, 
It's a lot of interpretations, though. It's a lot of interpretations. I even asked my sons because they went to see it when it first came out. And I was like, what did you get from it? And what he got from it was like, <laughs> what? Where did you get that <laughs> interpretation? Mm -hmm. So, you know, but yeah, if y'all saw it, please let us know in the comments what you interpreted, what you got out of the movie. And of course, make sure you grade it. Just like all of our other sisters from another Mr. Movie Reviews, make sure you grade it. Ooh, give it a 1 through 10. Ooh, cool beans. Um, give it a 1 through 10. Um, again, Sam gave it a 5. I gave it a 6. Because, mainly because... Ooh. I thought the Ooh. acting and everything was great. I thought the acting and everything was great. It was just so much... <laughs> they have scenes a lot too you see that it was just so much I think they just tried too hard to make you think they tried too hard because every time you thought something it was something else and every time yeah. you thought this, it was something else it was like <laughs> by the end of the movie everybody in the movie theater was like what the you know, normally how you leave out a movie, especially if it's good, and you're like, oh my God, that was good. I can't wait to come out on DVD. Oh, my God. I'm, I'm coming back. We need to go see this next week. I mean, everybody just walked out the theater like. Good, we came to the early show. I'm like, yeah, we did go to the early show, so it wasn't deep, but still, I was like. So, but, I don't know. Y'all let us know what y'all think about it. I, I actually liked, um, because this is the same person who, like, um, created or produced um, Get Out. Mm -hmm. I liked Get Out much better. I like Get Out uh, much better than this one. Get Out, remember the sunken one. place? The, oh, you never seen Get Out? Oh, you gotta watch Get Out. Yes. Yes. That, that. <laughs> I like that one. In the world is a song and play. I'm the serious. I'm play. serious. There was like, the I came across place, so many people who have said like negative things about this movie. <laughs> so, you know, if you haven't seen it, I'm not saying don't get it. Oh, yeah. It. I mean. I'm just saying. Because everybody got the own way to look at something. I would go. I mean, I recommend I going, so don't not. I think it'll be all right to go see it. That way you have to, boy, you know, have your own opinion about it. But, yeah. like I said, sometimes these movies, I think they, you know, take a little bit more time. Because they go away from what they, I think they start out for it to Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yep. But anywho, you guys, we so, so, so appreciate y'all for hanging out with us this Saturday evening. <laughs> It's almost 9 o'clock here in the Midwest, in the Omaha, Nebraska. It's almost 9 o'clock, so I don't know what time it is there where y'all at. But I really appreciate you guys for hanging out with us. This, this was our first live on our new collab. <laughs> How do you call it? Collaber? Collaborate? Collaborate? Well, we collabed, you know, on a channel per se. Yeah, <laughs> we together. <laughs> but not together. We sisters. <laughs> We ain't together yeah, like that. Yeah, we ain't better clear like it up. Clear, clear it up. up. <laughs> you like, oh, okay, oh, okay. No. They gonna be thinking, no, no, no. no, no. <laughs> you see my lips? No. no. <laughs> but anyway, y'all. Um. No. <laughs> be like, get out. Huh. Get out. <laughs> but anyway, y'all. Um, <laughs> enjoy your evening. Mm -hmm. I hope you liked our review and everything else that came with it at the hood. Did you did you get that? Mm -hmm. The hood. Not the hood. The hood table. <laughs> I hope you enjoy some of our stories. Um and our review. Mm-hmm. And I hope you come back. Make sure if you have not already subscribed, make sure you hit that bell so that you can be notified every time we go live. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. <laughs> and my part of be okay. So yes, please make sure you share the video. Share our um, platform, our link. You know, share, share, share. We're trying to build our channel up. This is our very first video. So, you know, we know how the process is when you first start a YouTube channel, so please wish us good luck. 
And thank you guys so much for tuning in tonight and showing up for our first live The Hood Table video. <laughs> hey, hey. The Hood Table. The Hood Table. Hey, hey. <laughs> the Hood Table. The hood table. Mm. 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 Remember the Reebok? Mm. Mm. I ain't. I ain't. I ain't. Mm. 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 Uh, see, them was the dancers that used to do in the hood. Mm. 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 You don't remember them dancers? Mm -hmm. She didn't dance. She must have stood on the wall the hell like a no. wall fly. I was out there trying to do the kid play. Try, what's that one dance oh. they used to do where they jump over their leg? I remember, I remember, they oh my God, almost breaking my knee caps so <laughs> many times. And when I would get it, I would like, oh my God. And that was when back then where we didn't have cell phones to record and go live and all that kind of stuff. <laughs> so I had no videos of it, but me and my cousin Feet, we used to always dance in the back of Grandma's house and her big old uh, concrete uh, patio area in the back, and we'd be trying to do all them dance, and when I first got the kid in play, I was like, oh, snap, and I could never do it again. <laughs> mm -hmm. I could never do it again. That is one dance where you have to be really flexible and really mm -hmm. small, like, really small, and I used to be really small. So, yeah. You can't have no super long legs and all that kind of stuff. She but anywho, anyway, y'all, <laughs> you know, we could go on and on and on and on. But we're going to stop right here. We're going to stop right here. What is this? If your palm itches, you're going to get something. If your crotch itches, you already got it. <laughs> I can't stand you. Anyway, y'all, <laughs> as usual, in the meantime and in between time, stay safe. Be blessed, and we out. Deuces. <laughs> you got to throw up the deuce. You got to throw up the deuce. Yes. Deuces. <laughs> <laughs>